What happened last week? Uh, last session was another slot fest. Uh, well, you the money hunters <laughs> or whoever your name is. Okay, the first you survive the onslaught of the Hamoy Tong. So you try to attempt to break a roadblock. So you you manage to survive that assault, uh, waves and waves of attack from the Hamoy Tong. So you you know you are spending your resources in terms of spells, uh, spell slots, uh, weapons, and also your health. So you try to find a detour away from the main road in order to be stealthier. You have even tried to avoid a village that you passed through uh, when you were with the guarding the caravan in order to make yourself scarce. And one thing led to another. So hours into your detour, uh, the road leads to a canyon that cuts where the river cuts through. So you want you are attempting to do a river crossing. So in the other side of the canyon on the of the river you notice uh there is a peasant girl or a teenager that was in distress so you notice uh two other peasants were assisting her to free her leg so cautiously you went to assist uh, bit by bit some holding back weapons at the ready in case something bad happened um, and later, you notice things started scurrying out the cave walls that adorn the the cliff walls, the canyon walls. And soon, you notice things that are crawling out. And you notice it is on lots of legs. It seems to be like spider-like with an upper torso that seems to be also rotting. The thing is fast and tough. So you try your best to uh, best it, all the creatures, but as time goes into the battle, more and more of these creatures start coming out from the other holes, the cave holes on the walls. The battle was tough. Some fell, but was valiantly recovered and saved and assisted by other party members using uncommon and untested, but surprisingly successful methods. You you notice an emergence of a barbarian librarian cowboy, <laughs> <laughs> and the attempt of Shen to use the kusari gama. But later, he chose to use the rope instead and managed to drag another party member away as they tried to escape. And in the course of that action, they managed to defeat several of these creatures, these crawlers, and they barely managed to get out of that encounter with one party member unconscious, and namely Kenis. So this is where we begin our adventure for today. All right. So some of you notice you you discovered a fan from a bag from the previous previous from the Hamoy Tong. The actually from one of the priestess of Turakamu. Uh, so. Where do we go from here? S, are we ready to go? Uh, yeah. I'm I'm right. set. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. All right, let's go into the map <coughs> of your location. So as you can see, I will continue updating the the maps. The more things that you uncover, discover. <laughs> so has the map loaded properly for everybody? Yes, yes for me. Yes. Okay, yes, cool. 
if you notice there is something called uh, that's written there crawler canyon i just would it, unless you want to put something else there death pit do not go a <laughs> 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 spider man cave okay Okay, that's paid to not go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, text will be in red. <laughs> okay, text in red. <clears throat> oh boy. Yeah, I'll put it, put it in red. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, is that colorful enough for you? <laughs> yep. I would just imagine that this is Gregory writing it. <laughs> uh, yeah. Looks like it. Uh, Funny he is the librarian. <laughs> well, anyway, <laughs> that's me, do not go. <laughs> that's going to be funny. So as you manage to escape, you notice uh, <coughs> one... Okay. You notice one of the peasants that you, you save is in front of you, uh, making his way uh, slowly. But he seems to be uh, struggling a bit. And as you, you are carrying your unconscious friend, you manage to stabilize him. Okay, let's let's fast forward to that. Mm -hmm. You notice that peasant uh, looks suddenly look heard something at the back, looks turns and notice all of you carrying your wounded friend, and you are all barely holding yourself together in in one way or the other. The uh, a wolf, a big wolf, a dire wolf <laughs> is still carrying Mononokehime. Mm. Okay, and seems to be looking past you seeing if there's any of these those creatures uh, following you or chasing and he slowed his pace for a bit until for, in time for you to catch up so he held up his hand as if he's trying to mean that I, he is unarmed mm -hmm. and then he says Kaisers you seem out of sorts and one of your party members seems to be unconscious would you care for some assistance from a measly lowly forester um uh, let's see who who wants to interact with this person first <laughs> <laughs> I am not a lowly forester. I'm just a, a a man of the forest. I hunt for small piece for small animals for my trade for fur, and I also I scrounge for mushrooms and herbs, wild herbs that grows in this region. All right, <coughs> what are you trying to do? An insight. Um, when he says um, uh, help and whatnot, I want to hmm? see if I want to tell if he's sincere or what. Well, from the looks of from the looks of it, he seems to be quite able-bodied. He then again, he is seems to be sincere. He kept raising his his hands, his raised hands up, as if trying to establish that. He is. He means no harm. He is an arm, and he is an arm. Hmm. Okay. All right. Um. I look. He is wearing a straw hat that co partially covers his face for a bit, but then again, it, you can see he is just a some sort of middle-aged man, <clears throat> and the straw hat is kind of usually worn by peasants in order to protect them from the elements um i look <laughs> around <laughs> I, I look around and then i look at uh lady 
Mara and wait for her to respond. The uh, Lady Mara seems to be looking at you and looking at your condition and she she nodded a bit okay and by by that I Abby <laughs> as you recall you give her that name mm-hmm. uh, um, I I believe we need <coughs> then she she sort of lowered her voice and talked loud enough for your party to to hear I believe we need a space or some place to shelter and recover what do you think master shen master that she she just <coughs> she cannot talk to elgar because elgar is in the form of a wolf <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? I believe we do need to to heal our wounded for a bit. You can see, you can see, Shenshui, Betty, bloody, bruised, poison, <laughs> and poke, poke <laughs> in many places. That's yeah. Say. Yes. It, yes. It is why. <coughs> let's take, let's uh let's set a place for camp. Ma- Mando Mandalorian. <laughs> 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 Can you lead us to a safe place to camp? He is unconscious. <laughs> He's also unconscious. Oh my god. He I think that, yeah, I think one of you is unconscious. I think as a wolf is unconscious, right? No, um, oh, it's no, the no. Mendo. Mendo. Uh, Mendo. Mendo. Mendo is unconscious. Yeah, okay. Oh. I have four heads. Four heads. Four heads. Ooh, yeah. echo. Echo. Truly four heads. Four heads. Four echo. Heads. <laughs> <clears throat> Give me a second, Jeff. Let me. I want to do a roll. Sure. Uh, that that place looks good. Shall we take a rest there? Uh, come. Uh, I have a place. Uh, this way it is quite a distance, but it should put some space from that fell creatures that that attack all of us. Uh, Jam, let me... Can I roll inside? Sure. Hmm. Right. Too wounded. <laughs> I, I'm trying to see if they have a... Uh, I'll say this, uh, ulterior motive. Uh. Mm. So far, he seems to sense that you are trying to ascertain whether he is trustworthy or not. And he took off his uh, hat, straw hat. And you notice that he has a scar on his face, as if being uh, attacked by that similar creature. I, I, I have been attacked <laughs> by that creature. I, I bear no ill will. I'm just offering my place for you to recover your strengths and yourselves, if you don't not trust me. You are free to end me here and now. Chen, Chen, Chen is a bit suspicious because the way he speaks, instead of saying my savior, he's, he's just saying this to like some random strangers. Does it seem suspicious? <coughs> well, we uh, haven't heard Chen, this Chen, backstory Chen, yet. Chen, mm-hmm. Chen, will, <coughs> Chen will look at look at look at the other guys, uh, Gregory and also you know, <coughs> and Karasu. Um, Greg looks at the person uh give us a moment and i say group meeting and i huddle everybody and then he says you know we can't really be picky right now um mendo here is kind of down and we do need a place a safe place to recover for a bit and uh Edgar here i think he's stuck in wolf form for a bit so let's just leave him be and yes, yes. lady mara needs rest i think do you? do you do you need rest you're doing great by the way i i, I am thanks to all of your effort to protect me all right all right so 
I say we take the invitation, but be on our guard. And I feel like he knows more than he's leading on. Mm, very well. Very well, take us, take us to a safe place to rest. Alright. Um, so I turn towards the farmer and says, uh, Thank you very much for housing us. For the time being, uh, by the way, um, where are the rest of your companions? Oh, they have, uh, they have gone to their their encampment. I stayed away from from the encampment because <coughs> my the nature of my work is hunting. Hunting, hmm. So, uh, why 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 don't we just walk and talk? So Very well. Okay, Shen, what are you trying to perceive? Mm, well, 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 this is happening, right? I'm just trying to see if if they are indeed farmers as they describe. Huh? There's only, mm. only one person. How about the others? Uh, they are not farmers? They return the back others to are not there anymore. Okay, so so how about the guy? The only guy there? Is well, he, he doesn't... Well, he, he, he never said he's a farmer. He said he's a forester. Oh shit! Yeah, he says a forester, but does he look like a forester? He seems to be quite well built. He can handle himself, and but then again, also he is scrawny, as if he is only eating as he needed. It's not muscular. So as we walk, I I, I want to look at his uh his legs, Jim. Mm-hmm. What so about what? his legs? Yeah. I want to study his legs. Uh, do they look like uh, the legs of a man who actually walks the forest, or is it? You no, know, does it look a bit like uh, someone who knows martial arts? Well, you know, the legs of people who walk in the forest are sometimes quite mus- muscular because these are quite near the canyon, and sometimes is uh, rolling hills. They are quite well built. Food hmm. fetish, <laughs> or either that, or you have a food fetish. Can I say But uh, but but do they? But the way they they move, the way they walk, do they walk like a martial artist, or do they just like walk like a normal person? Oh, okay. So far, yeah. you you sense that when you not you try to recall when he is in front of you, before he stopped, he seems to be walking like a normal person. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So anyway, uh, how long have you been around here? I've been uh, around here. How do you mean? I mean, um, this forest and whatnot. Like, how long have you been? Um, yeah, like. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I have been around here almost all my life. I grew up here. Um, the trade has been given to me or well you can see i inherited the trait from my parents mm. i see that's very fascinating okay. so i i bet you know a bit of the layout and the lens so what the fuck was back there <laughs> we call them crawlers i can see but um, what are they? They they look like spiders and creepy crawlies. Uh, uh, those are terrible, terrible creatures. They they usually just attack some of us who use this place as our <coughs> hunting grounds or even gathering places. Even our gatherers have some of. Our gatherers have been missing. I see. So, um, those other twos, um, they're um, friends of yours. I I have not met them before. I think they they look like gatherers. I notice they are in distress, so I just try to help them we've been here there quite a bit and i sense incoming danger 
Then suddenly you showed up and saved us. But how did the uh, young one got her legs stuck? It's a mystery to me. I just noticed that her leg was stuck. And that other person, I think it is her mother or something, that seems to be in distress trying to pull her leg out from that hole in the ground. Hmm. So, how well known is that area f- known? Sorry, uh, is that area known for its crawlers? Well, I will not try to explore that area. I have some close encounters there before. So, would you say that that location is dangerous and well known for its danger? <laughs> that is a. Uh... That is a mild way to say it. It is very dangerous. But I do not think I've seen them before. They may not be familiar with this area. Mm. And I just noticed that they are screaming for help. So I just took a peek. I see. I mean, it feels rather strange, don't you think? Or... What, uh, strange for... Well, lots of things here are strange. Well, I, I mean, uh, if you're local around this area, you should have, well, kind of known that that area is bad and you shouldn't really go there. You know, from folk tales from Paris and whatnot. Yeah, I will not. But sometimes I have to go there to to search for. Hello? Hello? The wolf speaks. The die wolf speaks. <laughs> Woohoo! Who let the dogs out? <laughs> All right. Oh, I I I try to avoid it as far as best as I can. Right. Yeah, but sometimes I try to be to be as stealthy as possible, because. They, those things sometimes react to. I can say, your heartbeat. Hmm. I think this they can sense, if there is a, a, a living person going there, then it will start, acting up. Hmm. Fascinating. Hmm. All right. Okay. I uh, I just find it particularly strange that um, locals here would go to a very dangerous spot. Uh, I I would assume so. Then again, I do not think they are well versed in the forest here. I've never seen them here before. Is there a town near here? Uh, there is a village. Uh, quite a ways that's where I usually go for my trade oh, but then again if I have a pretty good supply of skins or furs or some trades I will go all the way to the Akoma estate to do Hello. my trading Hello, but that was th- that's quite a distance yeah yep. yeah I think we can hear you yeah um, I cannot hear you guys just now. Oh, okay. Do you hear us now? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, okay, cool. So, the forester just uh, looks at you and and try to to be as non-menacing as possible as he can be. So, um, will you take up my my offer to find a sheltering place? Yes, yes, yes we will. Yes, we will. You can have your weapons at the ready. If you suspect me of doing any any harm or anything suspicious, there's nothing much I can do. I have my back to you. GM, I will uh, lead the way. Okay? Oh, all right. Yeah, GM, um, being with this guy for a few minutes, right? Yes. Uh, do, do I get a sense of how, uh, how, how he is in terms of... Um, uh, strength and stuff. 
he seems okay. Ah, uh, strength as in he, he does he looks like a fighter or something? Yeah, in terms of like, uh, he's not telling us everything, but his mannerism, his posture, the way he walks, the way he moves his body. Can I okay. tell that if he's ex- like well versed in the art of uh, war or combat? Okay, what you can see is that he is quite able to take care of himself. Uh, if you know what I mean, but mm-hmm. his back is a bit hunched, and there is a an aura of sadness around him, as if he he looks at uh, his eyes betrays that he he seems to be sad, or Shen looks at him and he gives a vibe that he is in a period of mourning or something like he is trying to to hold back some sadness this, from betraying his facial expression this shens notice this yes shen right. notice that for you for you you notice that uh, he has been walking in front of you for for several minutes before he stopped it seems like he is just hunching and just walking briskly and he doesn't seem to be acting menacing now looking at his physicality he seems to be able to to navigate his way quite well mm-hmm. um all right no problem okay um so i asked him uh how far oh, is one your... more thing Sorry. one more thing you notice he the move that he makes is quite similar to how huntsmen or even hunters uh move makes sense in forest in order to not disturb the grounds or even try to stir up lots of noises. Makes sense, mm-hmm. makes sense. Okay, mm-hmm. it seems about right. Mm-hmm. So I asked him, so um, how far is your place from uh, here now? Uh, if you, uh, I, I think it's quite a distance away because uh, I try to keep my hut Well, <laughs> it's just a humble heart. <laughs> I have to admit it. Away from from dangerous places, it will be a bit <clears throat> mere several minutes, but it will be away. Oh, all right. Never mind. Um, how is Kenneth looking? He's still okay right now. He's mumbling. This is the way. Who's taking by care of what? him? By the way, like I, <laughs> he's on the wolf. I'm assuming. Uh, yes. But who who's next to him, taking care of him, like making sure he's not dead? I'm assuming yeah, yeah, wolf. wolf. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, you you don't change no, form, right? You you are still in wolf form. <laughs> uh, if I'm not mistaken, I did revert back to my human. Ah, okay. No, so that's that's our justification for you not being here. Me. So you're still wolf. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. So, so you revert back. Eh? All right. All right. Okay. Fine. <laughs> okay. By now you <laughs> reverted back. Okay. Kedung. Oh no. <laughs> Get the book. Uh, <coughs> and, and then more, you, uh, Kenneth is mumbling by the waters of Ma- the holy waters of Mandalore. I shall be redeemed. Mm. <laughs> mumbling at this breath. This is the way. I live by the creed. <laughs> mm. Okay. All right. So, so do you follow that forester? Yeah, we follow uh, him to his hut. All right. So, yeah. <coughs> it's gonna. This is the way. Right, he leads you a bit, uh, always keeping a uh, safe distance at the front in order to show that he does not mean any treachery. He doesn't show to have that, and he is cautious. Uh, after several distance, he always try to scan the the areas for any possible dangers and later you come to a clearing and then there is a certain path that leads up to that kind says uh, we are nearing where i live if you do not mind it's just a distance up okay sure sure um all right so if i may uh come is is quite away from the normal path so kindly follow me again i will be just a distance in front of you so that 
you can do harm to me if you notice or if you suspect I hold any betrayal in my heart. Ooh, inside is twenty. Mm. I I I keep hearing this, and does this remind me of anything? Uh, anything of what? Like the the way he's saying stuff, like oh um. Uh, I, uh, I mean no harm. Uh, uh, if you think I betray you, you can uh, smack me down. Like, does this remind me of anything from uh, past, like uh, from my ex- 40 years of experience? Oh, okay. So far, n- not really. It's like something he is a, a humble man, seems to re- trying to ascertain, to, to ensure that uh, his guests, you are. Uh, Keep you safe. So, like, uh, I, I, I'm not getting any vibe that he's um, strange or particular or maybe military trained because the way he's saying stuff is really stupid confident. Oh, okay. Well, you know his the the way he said it is a bit uh, different, but. You notice that he means it. He really means it. He may be. He may have a life before, but the way he says it, as if he is trying to reassure everybody that he means no harm. All right. All right. Mm-hmm. Come, uh, this way, please. Okay. I okay. So him. is everybody loaded the the map? Yeah. Uh, yep. I... I will be staying close with Lady Mara and mm-hmm. escort her along the way. All right, all right. So, hun- wolf hunters. Uh, bottom. Uh, the yeah, tokens at the still bottom. Still loading. Yeah, I, I, I think it's uh, still loading. <laughs> okay. Right. And the forester. Ah, this is my hut. <laughs> I am sorry that. There is only one bed. There's only for me. The outhouse is out there, and he points towards this general direction. Mm-hmm. Now, usually there is a place that I think if you go there, that is a place. Uh, I think you can make camp and dress. All right. <clears throat> if you like. Oh, oh! I have an idea. Oh God! Waiting for Lady Mara to <laughs> move right. up. Okay. Shen 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 tried to look around, but he all he sees are wooden stumps. Alright. How bad are are we? Well, what do you mean by bad? Like character? Uh, 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 how in shape? Oh, how uh, bad? kind how of. We? Um, Mendo's being dragged by the leg, I think. Krang krang, luckily, ah, best karma, best karma. <laughs> we really need a long rest, is it? Uh, we, no. we just need some rest I, and. I see Mendo. Mendo is on top of the wolf. No, not There's anymore. No wolf. No, no wolf. Fine, I, I, I'll, I'll be. I was, I was carrying Mendo. Right? <laughs> so. Do we really? For so long. <laughs> so. Uh, and then the forester says. Uh, you can you can stay at that clearing. Um, there are there is there are places that you can you can just hang out around here. I wanted to once upon a time, I heard somebody called they establish a homestay. I only have a camp, so you can have a camp stay here. Ah, uh, <laughs> I see, I see. It's okay. Uh, serious question: Do we need a long rest? Uh, that yes. is up. Okay. Okay, I will walk up to Greg, and then say, hey, okay, buddy, do you remember the orb?" Oh yes, but give me a second. Caught. Give me a second to finish the deal. Um, I I go to the forester and uh, pat him on the shoulder and offer him a handshake. Oh, ah, uh, you have big hands. Yes. Uh, what are big heads you got? Uh, thank you for letting oh. us stay at the campsite. Uh, as I shake his hand, I would like to feel rage. No, 
<laughs> I, I would like to feel like uh, the texture of his hand, the callus, uh, uh, the locations, like me, just have a feel of his hand. Okay. His callous hands are from years of toil. Uh, he seems to be gnarly hands. Mm hmm. Okay. He is okay. The, the hands is not the hands of a farmer, but instead the may, maybe the hands of a hunter. Mm -hmm. The hands of the farmer may be uh, gnarly from holding tools of farming, but this may be from holding bows, arrows. Uh, when when I grip his hand, um, does he grip hard? Like um, how 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 was his grip? Like. A firm handshake. How hard is he? So far, is he is able to not that firm. Not that firm, but mm -hmm. able to match my grip. No. <laughs> and then, then you can see that his face is a bit. Uh, let's say if you you it's like trying to have a strength mm. test or something. Mm. Like that. And then you he seems to grimace in a bit of. Oh. Un Discomfort. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, I. Yeah. Mm, yes. Is hand, is hand shaking normal in this area? Mm, not really. No, it's bowing. Hmm. Karatu is bowing. Yeah, but Greg doesn't know that. <laughs> yep. You so, and me, the, the yeah. So, that, that's why he he is extending his hand like, like what? <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you trying to give me something? And then suddenly, boom. <laughs> yes. His hand ha is in yours. <laughs> mm, yes. Hand shake. Anyway, yeah. thank you very much. Um, if we need anything, we'll let you know. Well, I do not have much, but uh, you are free to to spend the uh, your time here. Oh, thank you, thank you. And then um, we leave the Forester B, um, and me and um, Edgar um, talk for a bit. Uh, you you were saying Edgar? Was it? Do you remember the op that you got? Oh yes. yes, 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 yes. I know. I, I, I think this is a good time for us to use it. Oh no, <laughs> the forest <laughs> becoming alien. What? 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 <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> yes. Um, I did. I try to did research on it. Try. Mm -hmm. But. I am not 100% sure what it does. I mean, I kind of think it's okay. tough. Didn't, didn't I release the information to you? Yeah, I did. Yes, but you're talking to Gregory. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, okay, okay, okay. You can pass it to me and I can try to use it for us. Okay, okay. Um. Here you go, and I pass him the orb. An artifact. Hmm? Artifact? No, it is called an artifact. Artifact? Or? Artifact. Art Artichoke? Hand out, hand out. Hand out, hand out. Oh. Oh, okay. What's that? <laughs> so, anywho, uh. Um... I assume all. Oh, okay. I assume all of us going up. Yeah, going to the okay. camp. So. Not everybody knows about that. So, are you going to sh not show yet, this to yet. everybody? Oh, okay. Not yet. <laughs> all right. So anyway, um, I'm going to stay close to Lady Mara for a bit. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. uh, we'll see what happens next. Uh, is the horse shitting? No, the toilet is here. Oh, that, yeah, it is here. I think he's yes. doing work. Oh, you are looking at the forester, is it? Yeah, is it is that a lumber or a lumber? Well, where, where? Which one? Oh, there. Uh, okay, you notice the forester is kneeling and seems to be like uh, offering oh. some, some prayers to maybe a shrine there. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, hold on, Jan. Yeah, let me read it first. 
So, let's see. While you are reading, <clears throat> anybody wants to do any role playing? No? Sean is. Uh, Sean carries the Mandalorian. Uh, actually, Sean, I think you are doing all this. Sean was carrying the Mandalorian. Mm -hmm. Over to the campfire and tending to his needs. Alright. Oh, it's a 2 by 2. So, AB by now is, is curious of that. And then she start asking. Is this place safe? Uh, to be honest, no place is really safe, but we don't really much. Uh, we don't really have much of a choice. Um, one of our guys is heavily wounded, and most of us really needs rest. Uh, I mean, we really should head back to your estate but mm, I'll talk to the forester for a bit later on and see how far is it to your estate but for now um, why don't you rest up with the rest of the gang and um, uh, recover some points yes okay yeah. very well right. all right so you notice the forester seems to be spending his time at a con that at that corner that seems to be like a small shrine. Okay. But can 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 you put the Mandalorian here? All right. So Next Mandalorian week. is there, huh? Yeah. Here, here. Oh, you can put it put it inside the fire. Ah! <laughs> no. <laughs> no, okay. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Okay. Yeah. So, I I'm looking at. Forester and what he's doing. Can I tell that he's uh, at a gravesite or like that? Okay, what you see is <coughs> this something like, or oh, maybe a small shrine, and it's more like a picture of a woman and a baby. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Alright, so I get close to him and says, Oh, uh, those were your family? And then he... He... This, he just suddenly recovered. He was in the middle of something like offering a prayers. And he just says, Oh, that... Oh. Uh, can you repeat that again? I did not notice you. I was oh. in, in prayers. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, are those your family? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's my wife and uh, my child. Uh, I see. Uh, I won't pray. Um, sorry. Um, I won't pray. But I do need to ask you a question. Um... How far is it from here to the uh, Akroma estate? Uh, I, I think it's about maybe about it took me a good 12 hours of walking. Hmm. Alright, alright. 12 hours walking. Mm. Yes. All right, no problem. Just, just, just asking. Um, uh, I, I leave you be. Sorry to bother you, and I move back. That's okay. I'm, I'm finished up anyway. So, uh, you can use the outhouse if you want to. Ah, yes, will do. So, I lean into Lady Mara and tell her that. From here to her place, it will be 12 hours, so yeah, uh, that will be pretty dangerous. And we're in the afternoon, something like that? By now, yes, it is in the afternoon. Mm. So but I, I, this, this place is, is uh, quite um, shaded. Uh, this is the middle of the forest, mm. and it is just a clearing. But if you you notice that it 
it can be easily defended. Okay. Mm. If there's any unto unto what's happening, you can easily defend this place. Mm. All right. So, but um, I, I just relay this to her and let her decide what course of action should we do. Then he he just talk to among yourself. I do believe that all of you need some rest and recovery to tend to your wounds. I can cast some healing spells from my time as the acolyte of Lashima. Oh. But there is a limit to what I can do since I am only halfway through my training. Ah, all right, understandable. But anywho, um. You you do rest. Uh, do take rest and don't overexert yourself. Damn. Yeah, I'm casting it. All right. And then I I so I get close when he does that. <laughs> Let's see what happens. <laughs> uh, for yes. Yeah. So just just want to let you know, woof woof. Uh, internet and PC got problem. So he okay. he will be uh meeting together with Kenis. So the okay. two of them the two of them are one. Ah. Oh. We are one, okay. <laughs> we are <laughs> legion. We are we are people. <laughs> 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 okay, okay. So, okay. What you do, and then as you are looking towards, uh, okay, Shen is looking towards uh, Abby uh, and the Mandalorian tending them. Suddenly, okay, ten foot. Sally Okay, you are doing that. Mm, I think so. Wait, does it specify that anyone can enter? Uh, any uh, friendlies? This is okay. This Not is friendly. the the interesting part. You you think you have to break it in order to cast it? I I you think sure? uh, uh. <laughs> so, do you do you want to do that? Wait, what why why I... don't you why don't you try and do an arcana check? <laughs> Here, I'll I'll help by doing uh, arcana yeah, check I'll with you. <laughs> I'll I'll roll arcana. <laughs> 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 yep, it seems about right. Even with advantage. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. <laughs> yep. And I break it, Jim. Okay. <laughs> okay. The rest of you notice something round with a base in, in Edgar's hands, and then he just smash it onto the onto the hard surface. And as soon as he, as he does that, something activated. It's like <coughs> something that looks may look like uh okay what happened to that? That is ten. Okay. Wow, much more bigger. Uh, <laughs> <coughs> there. All right. Uh, it's about ten foot radius. Okay. Yep. It's about ten foot radius. A a tiny hut. Blows up from there. So and then it is. It looks like a dome of force that springs into existence, and it started to appear as a medium-sized hut. All right. <laughs> as I did that <sighs> previously, I'll walk up in front and then ask them to bring. The mando into the heart. All right, so everybody can see this. Mm-hmm. All right, so it's a it's an interesting hut. It looks like uh, something like a snow globe. <laughs> now it is smashed, but whatever that's inside the snow globe now it has become a tiny hut. Uh, GM, I just want to clarify. Uh, magical yes. items are hard to break. 
Well, this one is breakable. <laughs> With that five arcana. <laughs> <laughs> What? If it were me, I would understand. But what? Yeah, yeah. Suddenly, yours is even better at rolling than than Rigat. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> the dice is really telling a lot of interesting stories. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, both of you are really bad at Arcana. Well, uh, <laughs> Gregory is bad at Arcana. So Gregory tried to help Agat it becomes make it worse. worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Well, let's go with that story. <laughs> that was funny. Oh boy. <laughs> we can rest inside here for the night. It will be safe for us. Yep. Then Lady Mara, uh, Lady Mara, oh Abby, yeah. oh you have you possess a great magic abilities to able to be able to cast such enchantment. Oh, it's nothing. Actually, we just broke it. Did we? And as I said, I, <laughs> I will do an Arcana check. This is it now. Yes, it is, Jack. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> You you try to to ascertain about that, and then you inevitably um, step onto the crash snow globe, <laughs> and now it's almost like dust already. The part, not the Yo, that is funny. Yeah, Jam. Oh. Wolf, yes. Wolf did a net thirty. So, <gasps> what 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 what, the, what did Wolf know? That is about? broken. <laughs> yeah, yeah it's broken. <laughs> About about the magic item, should they have should <laughs> they have broken. actually crush it or there was another way for them to use it? Well, uh, after, okay. here's the fun part. Uh, Greg step on it, so there's nothing much to to check. <laughs> except for yeah, yeah. Oh, twenty. <laughs> yeah, sure. Actually, uh, 20 once the magic item is broken or lose its magical effect, there's nothing to check. <laughs> but. Um, no, 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 but 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 your wolf 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 too authentic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. That's funny. Yeah, but um... yeah. So 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 wolf make, can wolf get anything from from this before? Well, yeah, everything goes. No, uh, there's no sense of magic except for a feel of safety around where the hut is now located. <sighs> yeah, wolf. Next time, next time we you we we let you handle the arcana check. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> yeah, two, two, okay, two, three minus one is two. Okay, suddenly zero. I mean, zero for him is normal. I mean, yeah, right. Oh god! I, I'll be oh, surprised good. if he was a net nineteen. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so you may take some long rest here. All right, so um, we'll uh, bring we'll... up the group inside the dome. Yeah. Right? And we'll take turns. Karasu, uh, are you going to move inside the dome? Yeah, actually, can 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 uh, Chen Chen, you're so <coughs> quiet today. You okay? Gas. Asleep. No, oh, no. He's active, I think. But um. Gus, he's sleeping. <laughs> oh no. Anyway, um, let's get everyone in, oh. and I'll take the first watch. Oh, this I, is going to be dumb. I don't think we need a, a watch whatsoever. <coughs> Alright, no problem, man. The, the spell, spell did mention that we are completely safe and everyone can take a long rest, I think. Hmm, okay. Me. Blah 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 blah. Creatures, subject, we don't cast them. Really? My Baba. Nine creatures, medium oh, yeah. size, can All fit. Uh, uh, other than us, cannot get into the hut. Mm-hmm. Alright, so uh, okay, it's okay. I'll move Karasu inside the the hut also. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Sure. So we'll 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 rest. We'll rest. So okay, before you rest, you want to do anything? You still have the bag. Well, actually, Karasu has the bag. Is it Karasu? Yeah, Karasu has the bag. Mm-hmm. 
drag Mandu inside as well. Uh, drag Mandu. Black. Ketong. Asal yang mesti ketung. Um, uh, I, I guess that's it for now. Um, we, we most most of us uh, got info about what we really need and want. So, uh, I I am good. I personally I am good. Okay. Ah, oh, Chen 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 is really out, is it? <laughs> yep. Out cold. Oh, but he was. I I I'm in the circle, right? Uh yeah, you kind of in the circle, yeah. Oh, Chen, uh, he was here. Huh? What? Chen was always there. <laughs> Chen was here just Yeah. Yeah. Anywho. Yeah, but Chen was uh, yeah. Chen is he was he's still there, but not sure. If he's <clears> there. <throat> so there is still that bag that he is holding. Mm-hmm. So yeah. So tell you what. <clears throat> okay, I can I can role play him for a bit. Jump so. on Shen. <laughs> Jump on <laughs> Shen. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you want to inspect the bag? Yeah, sure. That's I sure. can do that. <laughs> I can't check zero. <laughs> I can't check okay, you. I can't no check. one have identified. <laughs> yeah. Let's let 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 let's do a check. You okay. Guys, you, guys, you guys did enough. I can't check. <laughs> 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 yeah. So, uh, <clears throat> the the bag that you retrieve from the Turakamu place uh, is there. You you remembered the the fan that was retrieved from inside the bag. Do you want to inspect the bag? Sure. Woof. <laughs> By the way, GM, how? Um. What? How does wolf look like now? Uh, wolf. Wolf seems to be. Which okay. Uh. As in wolf hunters. Yeah, wolf hunters. Okay. It, it, she seems to be really well. She's badly hurt. No, I mean, um, she has the hot hat on, right? The what? Hat. Yeah, that 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 keep. Ah, uh, yeah, she took it off. Mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> okay, so do you want to check the bag? Roll Arcana, please, on the bag. Everyone roll. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be fun. <laughs> yep. You drink sick too early. <laughs> yeah. Uh, mm hmm. You you roll right. too soon. You roll too soon. <laughs> okay. So do you want to open the bag? <clears throat> yeah, up to you. Wolf. You want to open the bag? I will take one hour to prepare one portion of healing gem. Okay, so uh, <laughs> let's see what Wolf is going to type. Uh, you <coughs> can't scream at me, Jam. Please repeat. Uh, okay, uh, are you going to open the bag? Ah, <laughs> yes. Yes. Okay. You open the bag. Okay. So, everybody is close by, right? Okay. Kind of. <laughs> We're in a, what, uh, 10 by 10 uh, foot yeah. home. So, you notice uh, Wolf Hunters definitely trying to open the bag. And <coughs> she undo the strings that holds the bag shut. Again, as the bag opens that it seems to be like a whoosh of cold air that rushes out oh that's cool and then nothing happened so are you going to reach into the bag oh fantas uh <laughs> hmm 
<laughs> yes. Okay. You put your hand inside the bag. It's cool. And it's some some something like a, a wind, or is it a breath mm-hmm. that you notice in, in your your hand? And then you 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 you, you, wind you, <laughs> you your hand touch something solid. And that's what she said. Giggity. <laughs> okay, and there seems to be two objects. <laughs> GM, you're making this too easy. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. <laughs> okay. And it's it's like a long rod. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> and something that has some. The, the other thing seems to be curvy. <laughs> Ooh. So both, do you, 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 you like the long rod or do you like the curvy thing? Which, which is your preference? Some people like curvy, some people like long rod. Do you pull it off? <laughs> you, I mean, you, you, do you take it out? Yeah, yank it out. <laughs> yank oh, it out. What? Which one do you want to yank it out? The curvy one or the long one? Oh, oh, yes. Okay, yes. <laughs> Alright, okay. I, uh, both. both. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Mm. Okay, there goes the PG-13 <laughs> Yep Alright, yep. anyway Okay the ship, the ship's Pull up <laughs> the, the elongated <sighs> uh, Rod thing Seems to be a javelin Oh And the other it's, thing In a small the bag huh? In a small bag Is it? It seems to be Yeah It's hard to It's hard to believe When she pulled it out Uh it goes out and then it does it believes the the logic that something a small bag can have a full size javelin inside it but then there it is oh. there's a javelin that was being pulled out from that bag Ooh. That's, that's cool that's, like, that's very long what yeah, was exactly. <laughs> what, wolf what what's the other thing uh, it, the, it's something that seems to be curvy and pulled out. It turns out it's the limbs of a bow. Ooh. A limb. Oh, okay. A what? Yeah, and then she, as you pull it out, the the curvy thing <clears throat> seems to be to make more sense as it it looks like the the limb the limbs of a bow. It's a long bow. Mm. Normal long bow, is it? Mm, I doubt well, it. Okay, one thing that that is interesting, it seems to be uh, dark in color, and what? at the handle where what? you know where people hold the long bow, mm-hmm. at the center there, there seems to be uh, a carving of a dragon's head. Mm. Oh, nice. Uh, um, Rituals. I drew up. I drew <sighs> my you want, and I start to ritual cast. Jeff, that magic. Yes. Uh, Jeff, Shen Shen will see the dragon, the bow, and then he, huh. he will try to to take a look at it, like, close look at it. Okay, you will take closer. Uh, Edgar will is detecting magic. Yeah, I just want to know whether those item that Wolf just pulled out, Jeff, uh, uh, Karasu had pulled out. Is it have Karasu. any magical power? I don't know who. Wolf. Oh, uh, it? Yeah, does both of the weapons have any magical property on it? You you cast your uh, incantations and you try to define the nature of the two items, the javelin and also the longbow. As you finish your incantation, both glows Ooh. to indicate they are magical. Ooh. Noise. Which school of magic? I do not know. Hmm. Well, no one knows. No one knows. Yep. Can I take a look see at the javelin wolf? So, Jim. Okay. Yes. What do you want to do about that? Yeah, Shen, Shen <laughs> is studying the bow. Most yes. The dragon architecture. Uh huh. So from 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 this, he wants to 
he wants to check the background of the pole. Is it is it from Kurokamu? That's why is it is it from this this continent or is it from his home home continent? Does the dragon look familiar or it's some other random depiction? Okay. This is uh okay. The what you can see from that is it looks like Something that is from this region. At least the the head looks familiar to you. But it's different from the dragon in my region, right? Yes, it's slightly different. So GM, um, I asked Wolf for the javelin, and Wolf says okay. So I'm going to. Pick up the javelin and <clears throat> take a look. See, okay. Is what there any? Want to see? Is there any per, anything uh, particular distinct about the javelin in its shape and design? There are. Ins- it looks a bit. Uh, okay, <laughs> there are some inscriptions of like lightning. Is it on on the the long rod to have that? Hmm. And there seems to be some inscription that on on it something like one phrase. Hmm. Hey, Gar, can you read this? And I show him the uh, what you call this, the carving. Can I read it, Jim? The only language that I knew is Karatul Common English. And what? What? Where's my confusing? Oh, okay, uh, draconic, Greek, Elvish, giant. Which one? Yeah, that's a lot of language, man. Yeah. Oh yeah, uh, it's it's something like giantish. Oh. It it seems like the inscription is you can you can understand it. So GM, give me yes. a second. Uh. What, how, the javelin? How is it shaped like? What was the design? It looks like a javelin, and <coughs> at the first glance. Mm-hmm. But then again, the inscription is a bit elaborate, and it seems to be very well built. Okay, I, I'm gonna assume that at first like, glance, I didn't notice that it was. Uh, give me a second. I, if I'm not mistaken, giant. Is written in um, Gnomish, Dorvish. if I'm mistaken. Gnomish or Dorvish? It, either one of the two. Uh, but still, I I don't think I noticed that at first. But after Edgar says that, I notice it, Jim. Is that how it works? Yeah. All right. So, but first, um, how's the design like? Is it of this? Uh, is it in character of uh, character? Uh, nope, it's, it doesn't seem to be looking like a Karatur weapon. Okay. <clears throat> um, Edgar, do you find this javelin looking strange? Well, the the well, you know the javelin, the blade looks like thunderbolts. Thunderbolt. Oh, <laughs> it reminds me much. Of the green. You just you just watch Thor Love and Thunder, huh, Jim? <laughs> um, Jim. It is more. Okay, there, there's a lot of people. Okay. okay, okay, okay. Who's talking? Okay. Alright. Uh, I got. Go uh, first. No, no, uh, Greg, Greg. Okay, uh, Greg. Sorry. Uh, me normally okay. asking, the hmm. what you call this? The javelin. Do you have a picture of it? Not yet. Well. <clears throat> Dang, dang, dang. Hmm? Yes? I don't see it. Okay, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, sabo, sabo, sabo. <laughs> Alright. By the way, um, giant language is Dorvish. Dorvish, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, this. Okay, wow. so it's not... Alright. Alright. Ah, uh, it's two-bladed. 
Is it two bladed yep. gem? It's... It is more 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 like a glaive than a javelin. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, that's what yep. we know. All right. Okay. Um. So uh, looking at the inscription, uh, I read it in my head. What does it say, GM? <laughs> As you understand it more and more, it's it. It says, Shazam. Yes. Okay. Pertama tak nak keluar the second movie. I don't think I dah. It was one. <laughs> okay. Um. All right. So, I I I look at um Edgar. Um Edgar, do you mind if I keep this? Uh, sure. Uh, cool. <laughs> I have no confusion in that. All right. Cool, 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 cool. So I'm going to spend an hour getting attuned to this GM. Okay, sure. So as you get familiar with it, <laughs> you you realize that it is a javelin of lightning. Nice. By the way, it takes an hour, so I won't be yeah. doing shit. Uh, Shen is doing shit, by the way. Yes, Shen is doing something. He's trying to shoot outside. Target practice. I okay. think the dragon bow. Okay, and it seems like a normal longbow. Okay. Just got dragon hit there, right? Uh, well, uh, in your, in your observation, but then again, the, as you, okay, how many times did you shoot? Maybe three. Three times shooting with the arrow. Yeah, shooting at a, um, a three or something. All right. All right. Third times the charm. The third times. Okay, as you you shoot for the third time at a target at a tree trunk, um, you notice the the dragon head seems to peel out. Something like a greenish breath a bit. Is it something like a smoke or is it barely? Is it barely even there? It's just like uh, a small whiff of something green, uh, like a green gas. <laughs> then it's gone. It's barely there. You just notice it on the third try. Do I, do, I, do I realize what, what, what just happened? Well, you notice what you you saw, but you are not sure what you what is this. I will try to do do. <coughs> I'll try to shoot again. This time I'll aim aim and concentrate. You using the bow? Okay. So I'll I'll just roll for long bow. <coughs> okay. Okay. Uh, work a little bit. Oh, huh. nice! Wow. Okay, this time around, it is more apparent. Um, is this bow seems to be hitting with better a lot of good accuracy, and. This thing started to, what you can see, like the greenish thing seems to coat as you release the the weapon. It seems to coat the the tip of the the arrow from the the head of the dragon. And as it, the thing strikes at the target, a hiss pss, seems to be like. It seems to corrode the target. The bark of the tree is corroded. <laughs> this is an acid, an acid bowl. Mm. Okay. Hey, uh... All right. I'll return and then I'll tell this to the guys. Yeah. All right. So, Wolf, you which looking at that, are you looking after taking out two quite sizable items from the small bag 
You try to extend your hand side, and you notice your your hand goes in and in and in until it is at your the, the your whole hand goes inside the bag. Uh, but you did not notice any other items inside the bag. But yes, it is sizable. The bag does not seem seem to be like a normal bag. Yeah, we got a bag of holding. Not the bag of the worrying. That's good. <laughs> Concept. Now you, now you, now you, you say that to. Ah, uh, yes, your hand is kind of cool inside. It's, mm. it's as if it is in in a freezer or something like that. Oh, yeah, we'll feel it. sure. The ice property is still the gem. It's, it's not ice. It's not icing, but it's just a cool wind. Yeah, but uh, the cool. The cool, the cooling property is still there. Yes. Would you describe it as a refrigerator? <laughs> it is. Co- co- <laughs> it's a cool storage. <laughs> it's a cool storage. Oh, no, no, it is something. Well, you can you can certainly try storing something. <laughs> hmm. Next time. <laughs> yes, I will. Okay. By the way, yes. uh, Norman, mm. the javelin does not require a human. Oh, I mean, I don't know that. Yeah, yeah, you attune so you get the the info on it. Mm-hmm. You get, you the get way what? you yeah you can without identification you can know what the attribute of the magic weapon by attuning to it. Oh. Well, in this case, then I will try to attune to the dragon bow. <coughs> All right. An hour in it. An hour for that. Yeah, somehow my game doesn't want to give me the pleasure of adding the item in. Uh, okay. You need to use the pop up. I know, but it's not How the thing me it? popping up. <laughs> I've been trying. God dang it! I'll I'll do it now. Let's see how it works. God damn it! So, uh, Shen is keeping the drag- the the dragon bow. What's what's the dragon bow? I don't know, you call it a dragon bow, so I'm just co- quoting you back. <laughs> oh, he, he just want to see what magic item is. I see, alright. <coughs> so, um, after this, you want to take a rest? Long rest? Yes. Most... Alright. So, who will, do, does anyone want to attune <coughs> to the dragon bow? I will try. Alright. Uh, what you you ask Kenneth to if you he wants to bow or not? Yeah. Well, I, I, I just, this is the day for you. What do you mean he did? <laughs> he did. <laughs> because Kenneth is so so silent and he's not talking. But Kenneth, he's eating. He, he oh. did. Move. <laughs> ask if he wants the bow. <laughs> no, 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 no. Keep quiet. <laughs> he wants it. Okay, okay, but Jeff, I, I just want to see what, what what's the effect of the bow because Kenny's out. So let's just take, take a look at what the bow is. Alright, so you will later pass it to him, right? I'll pass it. Okay, so. Yeah, then he needs to attune you. Oh. A bony. Oh. Isn't it the. Oh, no, no, it's not that. So that's the curvy thing. Okay, good day. Oh, this is really powerful. Nah, this is really good. Yep. Really good, really good. If you load no ammo in the weapon, yep. it produces its own. Nice. Yeah, it's really good. <clears throat> yes, you can... Yeah, capacity, don't worry. But this one requires a tumor. Hey, these bows are devastating when used on a battlefield. But the love of all you who are going to have a, let an actual dragon see you are carrying one suddenly like suddenly I, it's like uh, yeah. fighting or dwarvish <laughs> yeah, yeah do, do I feel feel like uh, do I feel a familiarity from this ebony dragon bow does it feel uh, like, like a weapon that I've seen before um whole, uh, roll history please Again, okay, yeah. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> not simply, well, you have an affinity for dragons, but this is not 
something that you okay this kind of dragon is not uh, something that you you see at part of your family crest or emblem or even seal Makes sense. Okay. Yeah. And uh, Shen, Shen will... Shen will just hold, hold on to it until <coughs> Kenis wakes up. Then he'll pass it to Kenis. Don't worry. Okay. <clears throat> so, you will take a long rest. Mm-hmm. So, this is... Uh, right now, it takes some time for you to walk. So, it's about noon. Mm-hmm. So, take a long rest, please. Alright, thank you. Right, so long rest is about what? 8 hours? Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> As you you take consideration of uh, your struggles from the battles before, all of you earn another 100 XP for role playing from last session. Yay. Yeah, you, you just have that, that battle XP. Mm-hmm. I'll give you the role playing session from last time <laughs> so there's another 100 xp yes no anything yeah, every one of you all right How anything much was the one? uh yes. look and check i guess uh, i can't i can't see it the archive is not showing but we already had it right yeah we already uh, yes but i'm not sure if shen added his yet Oh, wait, uh, 950 EXP, which I don't think I did. How, how much is your EXP right, right now, guys? 19189. 189, yeah. After you added it, right? Yep. Oh, uh, 950 each XP from last session. <clears throat> so, at so, another hundred, that would be mm-hmm. yep. at another hundred. Right, nice, nice, cool, cool. <laughs> so, recover your health uh, and your spell slots and everything. So, even Kenis can recover his um, HP. And everything. Mm. Uh, do equip your bow. <laughs> <coughs> so, anything else that you want, Duke? Mm, uh, nothing much, I guess. Uh, we we'll rest up, but um, before we nap, I'm gonna ask. Lady Mara, if yeah, I'm gonna ask, uh, talk to her for a bit. Uh, okay. Uh, Lady Mara, would would you like to leave after um, this rest, or do you want to leave at the break of dawn? By now, it is night time outside. True. What do you think? <clears throat> I... Shall we shall we leave it to, right now? Because we want to be in haste to return as what was taught to me mm. uh, by my messenger. Oh alright. Um we'll leave after we finish resting up. Also, I think the hut will vanish after that too. So yeah. Yes, and then she she looks a bit contemplating on something. Oh, Shopee! Ah, oh, siapa Shopee? Chat gitu. Yeah. So anywho. <laughs> She seems to be contemplating, and then she seems to be holding her the bracelet that she is wearing, and then it is hidden under her disguise. Mm. 
But you know, you have seen the bracelet that she wears, the bangle or something mm-hmm, that that mm-hmm. is on her wrist, and then it's made of jade, and it looks like a dragon that is eating its tail. Giggity. That's biting its tail. All right. So I uh, I won't bother her much. So wait, uh, is this already night time? Are we done resting or are we starting to rest? I would. Uh, your call. I mean, right now the. Okay, right now I think you have taken rest. Ah, it's okay. night time already. So, uh, I'm guessing eight hours are up. Yes, eight hours are up. All right. So hut is gone. Uh, we. And the dome will also dissipate. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's only last for eight hours. Mm-hmm. All right. So, um, I look at the group and I go to Shen, asking him. All right. Um, Lady Mara says that we need to head out. What do you think? Uh, if that's a good idea, I'm not sure if it's a good idea, but if that's what you guys decided, then I think we can do it. I mean, we are in a bit of a rush, and we dilly dally a bit too long today, so yeah, um, we need to head out as soon as possible. Sure. Alright. During, during this time, Jem, I, I, I assume that we passed the bow to move to uh, Kenneth's so that can attune to it, right? He have to attune to it, but it will take one hour. Do we you want to wait one hour for him to attune it first? Or do we want to just head out? What time is it right now? Huh? Assuming uh, we spent eight hours um, resting up uh, at what, one? You count... Back uh, forwards. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine p.m. Probably. Yeah, it's about nine. Also, Kenis, what, what do you want to do? Do you want to attune to the thing first, or do you want to go? Can you repeat that? You, you, you want to spend one hour to attune? Or you want to go right now? To, to our destination? Okay. You guys, can, so you guys okay if we wait for one more hour so that he can tune to his uh, bowl? Um, why don't you ask the Dimara about it? Dimara, are you okay? Yes, I am guided by your wisdom. By the way, Jen, the dagger it needs to be refilled, right? The venom. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so, yep. Uh, Wolf, we don't have any poison, poison, or venom. So, so we will. Is it past the maintenance period, Jim? Um, so far yes, but it depends on the skill of the artisan later whether it can be revived or not. All right. Can we instead of poison add in diabetes? <laughs> or herpes. <laughs> 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 no, you, you know if, if you guys want, the it, they are the weapons that uh, we, we we got from the assassins. Maybe they got poison inside them. You want to refuse it with their poison? <laughs> I don't think it works that way. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I, I uh, guess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we wait oh, yeah. for an hour, I guess. Yeah, let's let's wait for an hour again. And woof. Uh, let, let's let's eat up. We haven't ate anything yet, so no. This hour, let's let's have some food. And then we head out. Okay. Hmm. Talking about food. Yeah, never mind. Uh, okay. So as you are waiting for Kenny's to attune to his bow, Lady Mara seems to be having a determined look look on her face, saying like, "Very well." 
you have been proving yourself to be trusted and powerful ally. I shall need to explain. Um, before that, I hand her a ration. Thank you. And she had that, and then she um, methodically started uh, nibbing on the ration. She is hungry, but she possesses quite self-control in order to look royally able and also looking quite able to function. All right. And then as she was eating the ration, she started talking about that. My family and this land has been under the protection of a great kami. We call her, we call it Jugan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, okay. In the, in the battle, the great battle thousands of years ago, our family, the Akoma, is nearly defeated by the forces of the shadows. We were all we were holding our ground at the last battle battle maps or the battle area that we we went where the standing stones are. We were surrounded by all sides until the Kami came and assisted us directly. We hold our prayers for many days before finally our prayers were answered. Jugan came first, followed by his twin brother, Kega. <laughs> and later, Yosei also came to aid us. Such horrendous battle was fought, but we managed to persevere until the great Orochi revealed itself and fought the darkness back. From the scales, when Jugan was struck by the shadow monsters, his scales fell, and turns out they were jades, and we used the jades, especially from the scales of Jugan, into our talismans. As we see, the talisman is able to protect us from the taint of the shadow creatures. I have in my hand one of the original scales from Jugan itself, and yours was given the pieces. The broken pieces that came from other parts of the scales. It is said through the scales and through the jade that we gain from Jugan itself, Lord Jugan, we are able to receive his wisdom from time to time, such in a way when two nights ago his council was to make our way as fast as we can to escape that area before they take the attack came. Wait, what, what attack came? What? What, what attack came? What attack came? It, it was not mentioned, but the attack seems to be imminent and his wis his words does not say exactly what but to carry the ruby away from the maho makers the dim 
open niche. Interesting. Speaking of the Maho, woof, you could keep keep these rubies in your in your in your Doraemon bag. Why well, you want to search the bag for a Tachikopta? <laughs> Tachikopta! <laughs> but, but, uh, if that's the case, Lady Mara, then we must make haste. Woof! Hurry! Uh, oh, sorry, Woof. Guinness, attune. Let's finish your attunement and then we need to make the haste. Okay. Right. Especially if we got the Guide Ranger, we should be able to travel through difficult terrain in normal fashion. Okay. Uh, Shen, can you roll a history check? My history's rules are good and bad, so this one should be good. Wow, lightning crossbow, what? <laughs> Light crossbow. History. <clears throat> Alright. So, uh, your history is a bit fuzzy because you are not quite a stud- studious student uh, in your family classes <laughs> about your family history. But, you you have a certain suspicion that your family's dragon may be related to the tale that Mara has been is telling. Shen, Shen got a feeling that about about that because you know, Shen met Lady Mara long long time ago. Not that long, I hope. Got a feeling. Yeah, <laughs> she's she's still a minor. <laughs> still a minor. That long ago, your babies. Wait, long and... time. How, how old is she right now? She is barely a, a teenager, also. <laughs> She's about 17. Yeah, 10 years ago makes sense. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> wow, you're better. <laughs> Shen, Shen is quite young. I mean, Shen is like, like 20 ish. <laughs> so, um, can you spend some time to attune to the weapon? And by now, it's about and we late at night. And we prepare ourselves to. Get ready for the journey. So it should mm-hmm. be just around nice. Lah. So yeah, let, I I think we are done. So let's let's make haste. And I think our friend Chen Chen is asleep because Okay. Alright, so as you make your way up, uh, as you start to adjust to your surrounding, you you notice the the area is very very quiet. Oh no. Oh, no. oh what? And seems to be like it's slightly a, it's the same but kind of a bit different than before. Oh god damn it. Then we go through the veil. All right, nice. Um it is a ruin, right? Jam. Uh yes. Yep, I know. Okay, okay. Such a classic Japanese team. Mm. So anyway, um, after hearing this story, which I may need to have a recap, uh, mm-hmm. I head to the uh, shed. Um, I'm going to pause here and take a look around. All right. So you see uh, kind of a ruins. Uh, there mm. are cobwebs that seems to be not disturbed for quite some time. All right. I'm going to... Uh, Knock yes, on the door. <laughs> Alright. Knock on the uh, door. Silent. Uh, and then open it. Uh, mister, you here? Silence welcome you. And it seems like it's a bit of... It, it looks like you when you disturb the cobwebs inside the, the hut, it seems like it has not been disturbed for a very long time. Oh, strange. I guess he went out. All right. Anyway, um, just wanted to thank him and you know, um, uh, tell him that we're leaving. But I, I guess nothing then. So yeah, let's head out. All right, Greg. What? Okay, you you just look at around or <laughs> what? What are you perceiving? Uh, yeah. uh, yes. Okay. Uh, okay. for 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 Shen right now, mm. I want mm. to check the, the shrine. Is the shrine still the same? The shrine. Is still the same. Uh, this was me. Picture, oh. The picture didn't change, right? Nope, the picture still the same. Is it like very aged? Is it aged age or is it like uh, still normal? 
Well, it's when you first came to it, it looks like quite old already. But the thing is, the the flame is still on, and the incense seems to be fresh. Oh boy! Okay. <laughs> uh, as for me, the perception was yes. to yes. look around the area, seeing how it looks like. Okay. And it seems like a, it's a worn down hut and has not been occupied for quite some time. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He did say that. He did say that. Okay. Mm. Hey, Greg. Yeah? Where? Ah, you're back. Guy. When? Sorry. Um, I'm just assuming that he went to do stuff. I mean, he's not really um, there to tell us where to uh, what he's doing. So I'm just assuming he's doing his own thing. Why? I didn't even remember that. I didn't remember this place being so filthy or untouched. I mean, people tend to... Uh, have a busy time doing upkeeps on their place. Don't 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 say bad things about the person's house. <laughs> okay. And I, um, by the way, <coughs> by the way, can I go ahead? Go ahead. Go ahead. Mind how long does this hut is being abandoned? Well, um. Make it easy for you. Uh, well, you want to roll a perception check or investigation? Yeah. Uh, up to you. <laughs> I, yeah, you. I think I think I would use investigation. Sure. So, oh. all right. It seems like as if the the, the cobwebs that you, you your nature knowledge it seems like it has been many many years. Looking around, investigating, do I find anything of use or might have known what happened here? Um, anything that seems to be uh, something that uh, any food stuff has long dried or spoiled or and also been rotted away. Uh, so far, this thing is nothing of value. In this hut, and there seems to be traces of fur that is being kept. But then again, after some time, it has fully dried up and cracked as you soon as you touch it. Mm. All right. Uh, right. Yes. I I'm going to lay some rations on the shrine. Okay. As offerings. Mm. Uh, then I go I go to tell the guys to I want to get ready. Let's just head out. GM, uh, I got a question here. Uh, yes. This I, I'm not sure how you want to rule it, but um, background is Outlander guide. Do I get anything with that? Outlander guide. Mm-hmm. You can click on it and pop it on the chat. Uh, but it doesn't really explain stuff. That's the thing. Like it, d- it, like um, oh god, oh there is there is something cool. Click on it. What happens? Yeah, click on it. You need to click on it. Oh no, it's not loading on my end. Shoot. Yep. Oh, there it goes. Uh, um, you do not own the um. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't Bye own me. it. <laughs> Bye, me, Jim. Yes. Is the light, the candle inside of this hut, and the stove, I uh, stove or burner? Yes. This stove, is, is it still on? It seems to be on. Strange. Can I detect any? Yeah. Can I, can I detect any arcane of nature? Well, <coughs> roll. <laughs> Arcana. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> mm, 12 investigations of Arcana. Uh, 
Well, it doesn't seem to be magical, but it's eerily unnatural to have something burning, and it doesn't seem to be logical even to have this candle burning <clears throat> all this time. Oh. Ah, that is peculiar. Guys, let's head, let's head out. Let's not dilly dally anymore. Okay. Eh, Karasu is there. Oh, Sanji Karasu is there. Yeah. Let's head let's, let's out. Let's not stay at this place any longer. And as Karasu offer a single ration and ghoul prayer while there, uh, a soft wind kind of blows her hair. <laughs> and I do prayer. <laughs> and there is some there is like you cannot be sure whether you really hear it or not and then it's just soft words thank you be safe <laughs> uh, <laughs> da, da, da. and then it says you're next <laughs> <laughs> God dang it. Yeah. All right, anywho, hey, yeah, let's let's hey, head up. Player, 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 the thing that guided us is probably a spirit or something. But maybe we don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. So let's head of blue. So let's get out. Why don't let's not stay here for too long? <laughs> you never know what's gonna happen. We already stay here for long. It's ten now. Yeah, yeah. but but, but yeah, time. yeah, just change the map, so let's let's, let's run away. <laughs> <laughs> so uh Jim, uh yes. the outlander guide thing. Uh, huh? I'm assuming that while we were walking around the the start area to here, I'm guessing yes. I'm familiar with the location to get back to the start point. Yes, uh, yeah, right, very cool. familiar with that. So uh, that's plus with uh, Kenny's uh, ranger thing. Uh, we'll we'll get there in no time, right? Yes. All righty then. Let's head out. <laughs> you as you head out, you buka Sri Bulanka. Rough initiative. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no, no. <clears throat> All right, let's head. Let's head. Oh. So now you you find yourself near the main road that goes towards the Akuma Estate, the Edo Town. Mm. But it's night time also. All right. Uh, first I will ask. Who here doesn't have any night vision or dark vision? Me, all of us, yes. All of us? Oh, only, except for Shen. And uh, also Karasu, uh, Karasu right? yeah. Shen, Shen, has, Shen is a normal human. No, no, no. Uh, except for Karasu. Karasu is the Shadow guy. Yeah. <laughs> now he's typing. Uh, I can target. <laughs> I don't know. So let's see. Um. Do we want to lit a light? <laughs> I guess so. There's no other way. All right. Um, uh, marching order first before we head out. Officially, really head out. Shan will be at the back. All right. Um, so, uh, I guess Kadis <laughs> and and the Outlander will be in front. I will. Uh, Minus one second level spell slot in GM to cast Dark Vision onto myself first. Alright, so at night you cast Dark Vision and then things are quite clear now at night. Right. It makes your journey easier. So. Uh, who's standing guard beside Lady Mara? Uh, I'll yes. be next to Lady Mara, standing guard. Yes, Wolf and also. Alright, I'll be. Kenis will be the standing guard. Kenneth, uh, Kenneth. Yeah. Hey, sorry, sorry. Let, let's read. Wolf, sorry. Wolf leading. Hey, no, sorry. Wolf, leading. Wolf, uh, Wolf and you will be guiding. Gu- gu- eh? Wolf and you will be guiding. Nah, the- uh, if that's the case, um, uh, me and uh, Kenneth will be up front. front. Yeah. Uh, Wolf and Edgar will be uh, mid with Wolf. Lady Mara. And... You and Karasu will be at the back. Yeah, you'll, you'll be taking care of your regard. Oh god, no. I don't know, man. You picked the back. We we didn't put you there, man. Oh god. <laughs> uh, I, I, I want to protect you guys from the rear. But you know what? <laughs> uh, 
Anyway, let's go. Do, 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 do. <laughs> okay. So that is the marching order. So night time you you make haste. You try to to keep yourself to the road and the the journey like the forester says, it, 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 it is quite some time. And then you go all the way in the night. And sooner or later, you you find yourself at the pathway. That seems to be... You detect that it is closer, but not there yet. Near to the Akoma estate. You, something that you can see seems to disturb you as if there are some movements in the road can i see what it is from here you you sense maybe some figures that is walking in the road but then again after that it just goes missing uh, just a reminder, GM, I have a 22 passive perception. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Well, there are some, some forms on the road that you don't seem to be... Uh, it doesn't seem to be menacing. Alright. Go, 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 go. Let's avoid the main road, I guess. It's but it will add up our journey time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but we, we got we got uh, got both uh, Gregory and also our Kenis. They can they can lead the way so that the journey time is like normal traveling. Then no, and the, and we we are stealth as well. This took him few Nidimara. Yes, I am. I feel safe with among all of you. you. Hey, Jim, the, the the ability of the ranger will allow us to move stuff here as well. Okay. Yeah. It isn't for area. him only. Yeah, yes, yeah, something I was. Doing. But yes, he is very stealthy. But the rest of you are loud as heck. The ranger ability is special. Actually, Kenneth, you should you should you should be the one referring to the ship, not us. The the background punya right. Yeah, I read it. It says only him if he yep. is journeying alone. On the sixth level, right? Oh yeah. Yeah, he he cannot make everybody else quiet, especially Unless... the one who's <laughs> wearing a plate mail or something <laughs> or half plate. I <laughs> do not have fast without face on. Do <laughs> Okay, fine. Let's double check. <clears throat> Soon you notice uh, for Karasu and Karasu, are you there? Yep. Okay, just checking. And Edgar, you notice a figure that is, seems to be holding a basket at his back. It's very dark at night. Alright. But then again, you notice it's still quite far yep. away. Alone, it's not for the okay. Yep, and you notice that that figure seems to be just like a traveler in the night, holding a basket at his back. I'll just motion or inform the others. Just keep it simple. Do not make any sudden surprise. Just act normal and walk. Okay. All right. Uh, where are we hitting, Jim? Down south. Down, down south. south. All right. Yes. Okay. Donkey south. So that means uh, yeah, me you and, and uh, Kenneth is in front. Yeah, Kenneth is in front. Those two lovebirds will be at the back, I and I am. 
that's your that's supposed to be your love. Ah, no. Nope. Why is it? <laughs> <laughs> Like, sorry, it was supposed to be you and her had a passionate night. <laughs> GM doesn't say it that way. <laughs> and you you notice the traveler is moving slowly. Seems to be walking. Quite far. So I, I'm just assuming that whenever I move, everybody moves, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will be by Lady Mark. And as you approach the traveller, he seems to slow down a bit. Um, oh yeah. Let's see. Perception. Nope. Stop. That is an advantage because it's dark. Yeah, it's still five. Yeah, Chen, Chen, Chen is getting a torch, huh? Chen is getting a torch? Carrying a torch. Oh, okay, sure. He has, he has to, because he can't see at night. At the rear oh, guard. Okay. So, uh, by carrying a torch, uh, you are also visible with that, lah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course. At the rear guard. Just have to remind that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah, hello. <laughs> oh. I didn't see you there. Well, I didn't you see doing? you there too. Because what are you doing at night? Oh, um, we're just traveling. We need to head home. What about Wait, yourself, Jem? Jem, mm -hmm. the traveler is is she he or she? He. Are they holding? He is he holding a torch? Ah uh, no. It this seems the, to be. Yeah. This is a very dark night, right? It's already yes. like. Hmm. Yeah. So sus. Hmm. Okay. What are you doing there, oh, young man? We're just travelling home. Can I interest you in some of my wares? <laughs> <sighs> Alright, so, uh, Kenis and Greg, can you roll a perception check? And Greg also? Again, All GM? Right. Yes. Alright, cool. Yep. How about Shen? Shen can? Okay, sure. Ah! Ah! Nope. Better. Mm. Oh, damn it. Net one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so uh, this is where Ken is and also Gregory in front. You, you, as you get near this traveler, um, you can hear something buzzing. Bzz, bzz. Bzz. Hmm. Something eerily. Bzz, 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 bzz. Something seems to be buzzing around where you are. If you don't mind me asking, what are you selling? You would like to know what I have? I mean, if you're selling. <laughs> oh no. Good to know that somebody is interested. Roll initiative, please. Ah! Yeah. I knew it. It's a zombie. Ah, <laughs> uh, boy. Oh, God. <clears throat> um, let's let's go. see. Just, Hi. Hi. And now I... Hello, <laughs> high. Wolf is back. Hello. Uh, Hi, Wolf. Uh, Hi, how, how, my... how was your date, date with Kenis? What the heck? No! Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought <laughs> <laughs> This Lord. is the way! You're going to fight Okay, Karasu. Is Karasu there? Yeah, we're, we're the Okay, roll initiative. You... <laughs> Did you doze off? <laughs> no, 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 no. Noise, oh. net 20. Oh, yeah. Net 20. Wow. Yeah. It is. It's a good time to try All your right. new phone. Your new right. Okay, is it you? Hello? Yeah. Mm. Who am wait, I hitting? Wait, wait, wait. It doesn't attack yet, right? So we do not know, is it? Yeah. 
technically we got no idea if it's hostile or not. Alright. Wolf Hunter. You can you can ready action if you don't want to do anything. Well, well, oh, we're, we're fighting. Yeah, we are fighting. <laughs> we are fighting. Bush. Uh. <laughs> yeah. uh. don't, don't, you, you don't have to fight. You know, sometimes just, just, just try and see if you can avoid fighting. Um. I wanna fight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. uh, okay. Wow. Alright. So uh, you are doing a mind sliver, is it? Yeah. Psychic energy. Okay. Intelligence saving throw. So DC fifty intelligence. Saving throw. Alright. Nope. It failed. Mm -hmm. Yep. Every Every what ah? Subtract 1d4 for the next saving throw it makes before the end of your next turn. So, yeah, the next saving throw that it has to make it must minus 1d4. Yes. Alright. Okay. Okay. It's my uh, spiked. I know, but no. Yeah. Uh, Alright, so. Wait, back. wait, wait, wait. 60 feet? Reaches go? Oh, I guess. All right. Yep. <coughs> uh, so GM with the uh, uh, what's my perception? The Twenty-two just now. I hear buzzing, but do mm -hmm. I see anything? Uh, you you, well, it's kind of dark at night, but you can see the the basket that on that he's carrying seems to be corresponding to the buzzing. Hmm. Rotten food. You think it's rotten food? I think it's 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 a it's a it's a rotten food. Ash. <laughs> oh, oh, a human part. Mm. Human. Mm. Could be a human head as well. We don't know. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, we've been fighting a lot without talking. Okay. Um. You know what? First thing first. <laughs> Whoa! Why did you do that? The guy was going to sell us something! And then I enter rage. Uh, still fighting? Um, and okay. I will whack this guy reckless and okay. uh, hit him with the uh, great axe. 26. Oh, yo. Rage. Uh, Reckless, eh? Yes. Okay, advantage. 12 damage. Uh -huh. Then again. Uh, what's that? Sorry. Oh, uh, no, sorry. What? Ra that's oh. rage. Sorry, that's not... That's just something. Yeah, it's something raging. <laughs> something, but we don't know what is it. Okay. Uh, I think the uh, reckless is only the first hit, right, GM? Mm-hmm. All right, so 16. Does it hit? 16. Yes, it does hit. All right, so 14 damage. Okay. As you knock off the the hat and the basket out of the traveler's back, mm -hmm. the buzzing sound seems to be more pronounced. And you can hear it. And as the the hat and part of the the basket at the back fell away or being cut by your attack, mm -hmm. you can see what he's carrying is actually a basket is just a cover for something that grows on his back. Mm. It seems like a nest. Mm. Mm. At his back. I way see. To close, buddy. God, that's disgusting. I can't see it. And the buzzing is from that nest. 
Where do we? Um, I was here, right, GM? Yes. How far was that? Ten feet. All right, I got ten, ten feet. feet. All right, let's see. Uh, okay, 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 okay. So back has Ness, eh? Yes. All right, let's test stuff. Um. After all that, give me a second to double check on Reckless again. Uh, reckless, where's Reckless? Okay, Reckless. Uh, da, 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 first attack. Uh, oh, on. What happened? I'm just reading. Uh, what? Um, reckless gives the opponent. Right. Uh, okay, cool. Um, <clears throat> so I got thirty feet left. I am going to run behind uh, thirty feet behind uh, the Mendo, so that will be there. As you run there, mm -hmm. suddenly the thing is back. That's his reaction or what? Reaction. Okay. Release. Uh, Outbreak. Release. Swarm. Force. Okay. Into space 10 feet. Uh, the swarm attack at the end of the outbreak turn. Well, uh, oh, so basically it's not attacking me. Nope, it's just releasing a swarm while you are running away. Okay. Um, and then I will end my turn there. Uh, GM, the first creature, this one I'm assuming, uh, yep. has disadvantage on attacking everybody else except me. And since I was reckless, if it attacks me, it has advantage. Okay. All right. Egar, your turn. Alright. So we are blasting, is it? Yep. Uh, let's just kill it. Yeah, I saw there's a swarm of Nessus. I will... Uh, I didn't ready that. Shit. Mm -hmm. You want to use your... Uh, Tidal wave. No. Flaming spear because it's an insect. I didn't read him I read a streaming spear I will take a few guys step back uh, let me see the range first uh, we'll go back here GM okay and then conjure a, uh, a produce flame Mm -hmm. Right between my stickle and then pass it like I was hitting a tennis ball with a tennis racket with the form of what? Okay. Oh god. GM roll a d20. That's not good. Yep. Ooh, I promise to hit. Hit fire the beach. On oh, this swamp? Yes. Yes. It started burning a part of it and you can see uh, the swarm started to dissipate a bit but it's still there okay, yep. uh, I don't have anything much and then I will EOT for now Traveller, okay So this thing started walking. And it will release a swarm again. Twice. Release swarm. Bloody hell, how many swarms he has? Huh? Two charges? And... 
it release one of this. Plague. Uh, I know we are clumped up. All right. It just released the swarm within 10 feet of it. Mm -hmm. And then the release plague. Obake. Obake. And now finally, you know what it is. No, I don't. It is an Obake. Well. <laughs> you have to roll something, Jim? Yes. It remains for one minute. Now. Uh, con con save uh, 17 Con save 17? My goodness yep. That's high Is it a uh, pass fail thing or is it just on a fail uh, on a pass nothing happens? 2d10 Oh 2d10 Ui, that's, that's quite high Alright Ooh, help me I'm gonna use a hero point <laughs> Okay, because I I, I I I am passing just a bit more. <laughs> oh, ah, oh, goddamn it! Shit, Lady Mara, Mara also is there. Okay, here's the uh, interesting part. As you can see, as the swarm started to swarm, or well, swarm is also swarming mm -hmm. <laughs> around you. Lady Mara seems to look out her her reveal her bangles. And as she touch it, a green light seems to emanate and surrounding her. Moon prism and also powers. And seems to emanate an aura of about 10 feet. Oh, countering it. Oh, cool. It seems to... Protection for her only. Well... Those who touch it, who touch the aura, the green aura, the talismans that you hold also seems to Be sink glowing. together mm. and glows within that light, with that light, and started to protect you from the swarm. Then I don't need to use my hero point! <laughs> Damn it. You did it too fast. Yep. I take the old 2D. 2D10. 10, Yes, 2d10, piercing plus, plus 2d10. 2D 10. Okay, 2d10. Uh, I got a 23 GM. Ayo. Yep. Nothing happened? And I'm poisoned? Nothing. Yes, you are poisoned. Really? Yep. Holy crap. It's a, it's a swarm of wasp. Wait, wait, no, no, it didn't say poison, right? It does say poison. The first one is piercing. The second one is poison. Yeah, I mean, I mean, but you're not, you're not, you're not poisoned. You take poison damage, but not, not poison. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. You are, you take poison oh, damage. You are not yeah. poisoned. Yeah. Oh, I take half. Oh, okay. That's a powerful spell. <laughs> Bloody hell. Yo, I'm at half of my life point for this. You, you need to walk. You need to turn the wolf now. Okay, after that that thing, it disappeared. Uh, GM, what about me? Yo, okay, sorry. You also have okay. You have rolled, and that's half of half of the damage. So you take five and five. Five five. That's ten, and then half again because no. Uh, we do you piercing first. Piercing. Yeah, we do piercing first. first. Yep, piercing is eleven divided by two. And then divide it by two again. So you get you are only two. Two damage from piercing. Alright. Then poison I take rate. half, so five. Poison is uh five. One, two, three, four, five. Alright. Oh boy. Alright, so that that thing disappears. You're safe, Wolf. Wait, 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 hold on. It's still sorry. I forgot about something. The other the the swarm of was also begins attacking at the end of his turn, the Oba his turn. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. All right, the swarm of wasps. 
Hey Wolf, just, just, just saying, uh, this situation looks good for a uh, fireball. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is Edgar. 19. 19 hits, 8 piercing. Alright, and this is on Greg. Miss. And this is on Kenny's. Not 20. Shoot. Who you? Wow. Uh, 7 plus 9. Uh, that would be a 16, right? Yes. <sighs> Give me a second to ponder and think. Uh, yeah. What do I Can have? You can use like 2d6, right? Let me show you that. Pretty good. Yes. Uh, 30 feet of me? I think yeah. so. That's yeah, that's 15. So, um, I see him getting stung by the bees. The bees! Mm-hmm. Oh no, not the bees! Yeah. The bees! No, it's wasp! Oh. Wasp worse than, than bees. Wasp. Oh no! So, anyway, um, I'll use a. Uh, on reaction, I'll. Use the spirited shield, uh, sending out my stand to uh, beat up some of the bees, <laughs> reducing the damage. Seven. So basically, still take a nine. Not bad. That's good, man. <laughs> Seven. It's very good. That's like almost average, I guess. Mm. Very good. All right. GM. Now it's Karasu's turn, I think? Yes, it's Karasu's turn. Karasu, your turn. Don't, 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 don't go, go too close, eh? Wolf can fire... Wolf needs to firewall them. How? Like, it's a 20-foot... Like, it will still hit most of the party members. No, he can aim fireball at 20, so he can just aim, like, 20 feet. You know? So that you, you won't hit the, all the party members. See? 20 feet? 20 feet, 20 feet. Oh. Yeah. Never mind. Okay, I'll wait until this, and just I'm... Uh, the usual stuff will be Edish Blessing. Oma- oh, before that, I, uh, I'm gonna place my Hexblade Curse mm-hmm. on okay. this uh, Obake. Okay. Suddenly, yeah. suddenly reminded of the Protoss. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. You mean you mean the Zerg, right? Not Protoss. Uh, no, the the Protoss is the one with the wasp looking ships. <laughs> Remember the mother ship? Ah, those things. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep, that's true. That's true. Mm-hmm. Okay, just gonna add this plus the Obaki. Oh, okay. Did <laughs> Easily, oh. because it, it it is slow moving, you easily shoot it, but it seems like angering the hive even further. Okay, then another edge plus. Boom! Oh wow! Oh, easily. Hitting it. That's weird. I need to read on my head split case. Does it trigger? No. I didn't. If it you go. Can I ask it? Mid, okay. Okay, mm. so it triggered my uh, has blade curse on it. It's yeah. curse. You, you, you yeah. get bonus damage rolls. No? 
against yeah. the target. But actually, it's not a roll lah. Dia macam tiga necrotic damage je. So, so, plus it's so, how, how much is your, how much is your proficiency? It should be three, right? Yeah, three. So, oh, it's six lah. For every, every attack. Is, do you have any 19 or 20 hits? Jadi tak ada bonus, uh, dia apa? Dia itu kalau crit, crit. Maksudnya, I crit, uh, bila I attack dia, I crit on a 19. Or 20, yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Strong, man. See? The hexplit curse, you should use it more. <laughs> but use it properly lah. <laughs> Alright. Poison. No, it's, it's not poison. Cannot be poison. <laughs> it's not poison. Why is it explain curse? It's a curse. Why are you going to go? Apa sign curse ni? Eh? Korak, what's the best book? Don't worry. No. Is it apotic? Oh, okay, sure. So, minus three. Okay. Two minus six, but two, two kali attack. Alright, sure. Cool. Then I'm going to your tea. So, we wait for... Who, who, who is poison? No, not poison. Nobody I'm, I'm no, nobody's poison. I'm just trying to find the right, uh, thing on the thing. So I, I consider it as marked, lah. Cursed. Just no. <laughs> yeah. So Kenny's. Come on, so Kenny's. Kenny's up for dah. Kenis, are you there? Oh, yeah. okay. You want? Yes. There is a swarm of wasps that is facing you. It looks like angry wasp. Right in front of you. Mm. Now, now, now I know how GM feels when he's playing this car. Like, oh, so many familiars, huh? <laughs> Carl can, can shoot lasers with his familiar. <laughs> then they got the fate, fate to stab you. <laughs> and let's go back to darkness. <laughs> That's annoying. <laughs> Whoa. Mark on the wasp, is it? Obaki. Oh, Obaki. On the guy. guy. Oh, on the guy. Okay, Mark. Because he was measuring to the Obaki. So like, hmm. Oh, okay. Sure, sure, sure. He wants to try the bow. <laughs> GM, I uh, want to know about the Lightning Javelin. Mm -hmm. What property is it? <laughs> that is an interesting question, right? Uh -huh. uh, well, you have you have looked at it. Uh -huh. And so far, the Lightning Javelin, okay, one, is a magical weapon. Uh -huh. Well, if you will hurl it and speak the command word, uh -huh. it transforms into a bolt of lightning. I forming a line of 5 feet wide that extends out from you to a target within 120 feet. Mm -hmm. oh. Every creature in the line, excluding you and the target, must make uh, DC 13 deck saving throw, taking 4 D6 lightning damage on a field save. Mm -hmm. mm. But uh, the base property is still a javelin, right? It is a javelin. Alright, so it's a melee weapon then? Yes, it is. Alright, then. Uh, well, that's well, all well, I need it, to know. It, 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 no, it's uh, melee, and then if you throw it, it becomes a range. Uh, <laughs> uh, here, here's the thing about um, the dumbness about, what you call this? D&D uh, is still considered as a melee weapon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all I need to know, GM. Okay, fine. Okay, Ebony Longbow. Okay, on the guy. So, oh. Ebony Dragon Bow. Hits and hits. Wow. And six. Yeah. Poison six. You need, Poison. To, you need to fix the mod, huh? Later case. Yeah. The mod mm. is two. If you change it to one. But the damage is correct. The, okay. The That's the first shot. Alright. Okay, go ahead. Second one. No oh, oh my crit. god! Crit. Okay, remember th this. Remember the poison also crits. Uh. 
So, yeah. Ooh, uh, nice. Wait, nah. You, you, you get an extra 1d6 of poison damage. So, so the first one is only uh, your normal one. So, roll... Okay, so roll... Total of 3d6. Uh. It, it, yeah, some mistaken. Right, Jam. The, uh, the Dragon Ball adds 1d6. Uh, yes, it should be adding that. Yeah, so roll 3d6. Uh. 3d6, yeah. yeah you have to adjust what? that because on hit, you have that, that uh, other thing than the, the first line is added. Whoa, nice. Oh, nice. Mm, and eight. also your... And also another d6 for the Hunter's Mark. Mm, yep. Yes. Yeah, roll another d6. Right. The first, first one you already roll. Oh, the... Ebony Dragon Bow deals damage in poison. It's uh, not, not in poison, uh, but it's piercing and poison. Mm. Nah. <coughs> so right, it's so acid. acid actually, not poison. Acid. <laughs> acid, acid. Yeah. Alright. It's a very powerful weapon. Yeah. Alright, anything else? I think uh no, you, you need to roll another D6. Can I see? Mm. Roll another D6. That's for the crit, right? No, this one is for the hunter's mark. Oh. Hunter's mark. Another D6 as well. Five. Okay. So yeah, the, the, the D6 and is... And another one. one. Because you crit with that, so the Hunter's Mark also crit. Oh. So you need to roll another. Hunter's Mark stack? Yes. So <sighs> Hunter's Mark crit as well. Damn. So roll another D6. Wow. Yeah. Mm, ten. Wait. See? That's suddenly, why new, like... suddenly new weapon, you boom, 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 like that. Oh. <coughs> that's, why, that's, why, that's why you can just take the weapons, okay. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Alright, okay. <laughs> Mm. Suddenly, suddenly you felt what the the fight that you encountered all this two nights before suddenly it's worth <laughs> it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, anything else? All right, Shan, it's your turn. Yeah, it's, it's the Obake holding anything. It doesn't seem to be holding anything. Hey, other, hey. other, and then you can see there the the nest wasp at the back. I got you can you can handle yourself, right? I can heal myself, yeah. Probably. Yeah, you can, you can, I think you can transform into a wolf or any form, so you will still stay. For me, I have to stay here to protect the Dimara in case the wasp comes in here. <laughs> yeah. You two should have changed places. I mean, I was at the rear guard, so. <laughs> Is there any ambush from the back? Mm, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Mm. We, yeah, we no. totally understand. You you need to protect your girlfriend. Quang, quang, quang. Anything else, Shen? Uh, fine. You will do ready action or what? Okay, I'm going to use a, a longbow on Obake. Ooh, okay. Oh, oh, God, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh god, no. Oh wait, oh. Uh, GM, need to ask, yes. if yes. he's shooting a longbow at this distance, uh -huh. he think, let's just say Lady Mara or even Karasu, is at disadvantage, uh -huh. right? Uh, this is a fumble. No, I mean, any, uh, because any... um, when you shoot a ranged weapon at close range, it's at disadvantage. Yes, but if it is already a uh, uh, fumble, anything can happen. Ah, so it's uh, okay. so it's like twing. It's Let me get the chief. Let me get the chief ready. Ricochet, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and ricochet or anything like that. So within ten feet. So within ten feet is ten feet ah ah that thing ten feet thirty feet. Hey, ten feet yeah ten feet ten feet. Okay, this is ten feet from you ha ah, <laughs> Oh, God. So yeah. one, two, three, four. So we start from Karasu is one, Lady Mara is two, uh, Wolf is three, and Edgar is four. I'm sorry. One yeah. D four. Oh no. One. Ah, Karasu. Oh, Karasu. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What's that? What's that? Yes. It's fine. Karasu got high armor. I I don't think you can hit him. Okay. Just roll another one. <laughs> 
Ay, ano ko? Kasi na yung TNT. Lagos. Nice. Ricochet of whatever protection that you have. Protection. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this is a proper one to shoot at Obake. Okay. Die, Obake! Oh, alright, very well. Okay. Jum, 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 jum. Whatever the thing on his back, make it easy target. So it just choo, 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 absorbs. And the swarm, the, the thing at nest at the back, it seems to be getting angrier. Yeah, if, if, yeah, let me check. If, if prone, do you have any disadvantage in any save? What? If you're prone, do you have any disadvantage in any saving throws? You are prone. I think the the, the rules apply lah for that. In which yeah. you have a disadvantage. No lah, yes. If you are stage on attack rules only. Yes. Not yeah. save. Okay, okay. That's fine. Then let's do that. Okay, that's it. No, I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna do anything. Focus it. I am. And I tell Lady Mother to you no, know, uh, fall fall back, fall back, lah. Yeah. Now, oh, woof! You use your fireball. Bam! <laughs> oh, woof! Hmm. Uh, do what? Lola. I know, I'm I'm team speed to fireball. Anything you want to use actually? You I want need to thing. You, you can summon your dream dog to you at the Yeah, you you're not about to pull it. Well my fire I don't even think a fireball will hit all of them. Doesn't matter lah, but you can hit at least most of them. If you it's want um... if you don't want it's also fine, you can use another stuff. Yeah, I need Where is where is No, 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 that's fine. Yeah. Uh, oh, move that pen in it. No, move, go close. Move, go close. Stay away. Stay away. Please, ten. Okay. I'll go here. Um. Oh, what you use? Dish. 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 Bane. You are casting Bane on what? Um, all the wasps. Okay. Alright, all the wasps. Okay. Okay, the one fully on the What's the range? 30 feet. 30 feet. 30 feet, 3 creatures that I can see. Yeah, so yeah. basically 1, 2, okay. 3, yeah. Alright. You want to do it on the wasps instead of Obake? Yes, it's 30 feet. Obake is uh, more than 30. Yeah. That's my saving throw. <laughs> okay. This is going to be interesting. Was I have a high charisma. Was is it charisma? <laughs> wow, minus five. It's minus five. It's not a charismatic one. <laughs> okay. Uh... Must roll a default. Okay, subtract the number. Okay. Oh, attack roll on saving throw. Okay. The first was... Fail. The second was let's see charisma again, and ooh, quite high. <laughs> Hello. Hello. That's a very charismatic was. Okay, this is the was in front of Kenny's. <laughs> Hello. I still fail. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, All failed. All failed. Okay. They're not charismatic. <laughs> I'll fail. Then. Right. Yeah, they're, they're gonna pass it, bro. Then. <laughs> <sighs> I'm dead. Ah, clever, bro. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, okay, so, Greg, it's your turn. Alright. a swarm of wasps facing you. Hmm, okay, I'm gonna try something. Um, I'm gonna take the new javelin out and okay. I'm gonna chuck it at the Obake. As I chuck it, I say the magic word. 
you want to make it a straight line so you can hit the wasps and also that's what I'm doing yeah yep uh, I'm gonna chuck it at the Obake and I say the magic word Shazam <laughs> sorry um, when I do that when I do that oh. I also use reckless okay so that will be a 25 uh, rage 2 7 piercing with 18 lightning what the f I, I guess it's automatically calculated GM yeah and while that's happening I run towards the Obake wait <coughs> run again okay fine uh, any attack opportunity jalan jalan uh, okay Anything? No? Yes? It will try to bite you. Bite? Swat it. Swamp. <laughs> <laughs> and then um, I'll grab the javelin and do a... Uh, I'll do a normal attack because I, I can only do it once per day, right? You cannot, you, you, you cannot use the... You need to pick up the javelin, you need to use the uh, action. Yeah. Action? Action to pick it up. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Ooh. The swarm of what is very agile. <laughs> That's no. first. Wow. That was that was funny. Okay. So the yeah. Obake. Swarm of us. Yeah. Makes sense. Obake and also. <laughs> Holy shit! What the heck? Whoa. But still half Whoa. the damage. Yep. So okay. Uh. Forty six. Oh, it, it rolled already, is it? Yeah, it rolled, it rolled yeah, already. It rolled. 12, 7 that, piercing, 12, 18... Um, so, lightning. 6 ah. Minus 6. Hmm. Also, you plus 2 rage? Rage is... Don't think you can half rage, right? You can. No, lah. No, no, no. No, no, no. So, rage you can rage. rage. Okay, so no, you don't the, half rage. The, so you... the pacing and also the rage damage is, is fixed. Just like the hmm. lightning. Oh, lightning... He can save. He made the save for the lightning. Ah, okay. <clears throat> All right. Um, okay, so with the well, um, since I'm in front of you, okay. Let's do this. Uh, does it hit GM? No. On that unarmed strike. Yeah. Uh, yes, it does hit. Oh. You swat the thing. <laughs> you managed to break some of the the wasp nest. Okay. She, she agree. You can just use your axe. It's, it's okay. Can the GM? Well, you have already tried retrieving that, but that is. I mean, I chuck the javelin, uh -huh. and then my plan was to pick it up. But people say I need to use an action to pick it up, so cannot. So okay. right now I'm kind of. Like, no weapon in hand because I threw the javelin. Yep. So that's an unarmed yeah, unarm strike. Yeah. So I. I so what? Uh, Shen is telling me that I should pick up my axe and swing at it. No, you what? you 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 have your axe, right? You can just draw your axe. Yes. Can uh, I do it? <laughs> no. Uh, okay. You you initially have your javelin, and then you threw the javelin. Mm -hmm. You have you yep. don't have no weapon in hand. Yep. So I'm 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 cool with that. So, okay. five, uh, seven damage. <laughs> yep, take it already. Alrighty then. So, I'm going to stand my ground and. Yeah, in the turn here. Alright, I got. You have. You're um, facing a swarm of wasps in front of you. I will face it. And then. <laughs> Ah! Oh no! <laughs> uh, as a bonus action, just cast healing word onto myself. Oh, okay, that's it. Uh, level two. All right. Ooh. So seven. Okay, that is a bonus action, and then as an action, I will hold my sickle and then 
use it making transform into a mantis like floor and swing to the the wall Ooh, all right. I just almost said all the. So fifteen, can I attack it up? Can I? All right, five acid. Five acid damage. Some of the walls started melting. Uh, was first it was uh, some of the wings <coughs> seems just melted away easily, and then it became lifeless on the ground. Oh no! Right. Some of it lah. Some. Animal booty, animal booty. <laughs> Lol. And then I think the that's nothing much. E O T. Hmm. All right. And the Obaki, interestingly, started to move away. Uh. Mm. Slap it yep. in the face. No, because if I do that, I cannot use the damage reducer. Uh, so I need to uh-huh. play smart because uh-huh. <laughs> if I... Technically, he's going to attack three times uh, on on his end turn. So it's like... Mm. That's true. That's true. That's true. By the way, GM, uh, what happened to my javelin? Well, you may retrieve it. I mean, what, where, where is it now? It, it is at the feet. My feet? Yes. All right. Because cool. you hit it at Obaki, and then it's on the feet. All right, cool. No on problem your... then. Um, I will not use my reaction to attack him. Okay. And it will release more swarms. <laughs> oh, oh. I knew it. And... More swarms. And oh. Where are you going? I thought you wanted to sell something. And then he started releasing him. A plague. Oh, fuck. Okay, it's like now. <clears throat> Alright, so What does the plague do? It, it does what it does So This one uh, Hits everybody Including the wasp uh, The wasp is immune Alright So Con save, right? Yes, con save DC uh. 17 Canis And Greg Alright mm. Wah Okay that one toy. <clears throat> wow. Okay. So 2d10. This is piercing. Mm. 17. Half of it. Ouch. Technically, uh yeah. Kenny also gets half of it, right? Yes. Yeah, so 16, uh, half of it. So eight. 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 Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, this is from the stick poison. Nine. Nine. So it's four. Or if you uh, for Kenneth, you have it. Oh, um, I don't. So I'll take the full nine. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Anything happen? And uh, no, no poison stuff. Nothing. No, there's a poison. It's right. poison damage. All right. Okay. Then. Now the wasp start, started attacking. Which one? Uh this one first. All right. We'll start to try to sting you. Nineteen. Attack with advantage because I'm reckless. <laughs> okay. 19, so 7 piercing. Half. Okay, this one. Uh, GM, what's half of it? Uh, half is 3. Alright. This one will also try to attack you. Start swarming you. 19, Ooh. 10, 5. Okay. 5. Uh, give me a second. Alright, uh, I'm going to use stone endurance for this one. Okay. Uh, stone endurance is 
Ah, uh, boy, is that a reaction? Yeah, uh, sorry guys, I need to do this. Uh, I roll d12 plus constitution modifier, that's a 2, and then uh, reduce the damage. So, what, d12? 1d12, that's a 10 plus 2? So I reduce it to 2, so getting 0. Okay. Okay, next will be the Swarm of Wasps in front of Kenny's. 18. Does it hit? I think it does. <laughs> so, take 11 piercing. The next will be the Swarm that suddenly started, well, surrounding. Oh no. That's what Swarms do. And starts... 12 miss. Wow. And finally, the swarm in front of Edgar. Yeah. Miss. Ah. Miss Badly. Badly. Natural weapon. Natural weapon. Okay. <laughs> and that's it. The Obaki also ends the turn. Arasu, what are you going to do? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, with that. And... Improvise pack weapon. Yeah. Improve pack weapon. You can use any weapon you summon with a pack. Of the blade feature as a spell casting focus for your warlock. Yeah, you're summoning spell. your pipe weapon. In yep. addition, the weapon gains a plus one bonus to attack damage on rope. Hmm. So I'm gonna summon up my black <laughs> crossbow. Noish. Alright. Right. And I'm gonna make my attack with my light crossbow. Targeting? Targeting the Obake. Ah, so you're gonna curve the bullet. Possible. <laughs> wow. You think this is wanted or what? <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> That's the wall there. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Anyway, before okay, maybe before that, I, I'm gonna move. Ah, boo! <laughs> you could have curved the bullet. <laughs> <laughs> no, because if I it that uh, on me lah, I will high level after this shit. So how far can hey, wait, 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 the TP at? I'm going to move here. So, I'm going to move here. Okay. Okay. I'm guessing avoiding the swarm, right? Are you going to avoid the swarm or you just go through the swarm? Uh, because, maybe from here, from here. Uh, okay, then I'm going to go through the swarm. Oh. Go through the swarm. All right. All right. Dang. That's the safest route. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Not so that. You, you went through the swamp. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I can't do shit. Yeah, my is is uh twenty four. Is it twenty four? <laughs> yes, twenty four. <laughs> ah! You are not unscathed. Suddenly, your. Si well, your your sizable Bosom. stuff is, is suddenly more sizable with sub sub <laughs> other bumps on it. <laughs> oh yeah, but yeah, that's true. The swamps are bane, but 
for sure he rolled a crit, so he still hits. No mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. Oh boy. <sighs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. The fireball would kill a lot of them. <laughs> but everyone's <laughs> in them. So, we done that. So, can I make my attack now? Yes, please. Hang on, please be good. Please be good. Don't forget to take the damage later. We all. Oh. Nice. Okay. It hits, right? <clears throat> it does hit. Okay, that hits. I'm gonna add this my it. Ooh. Ooh. Oof. Oh, Wait, is it? Uh, upon hit or, or so you have you to activate it when first. you hit a creature. Okay. Strong. You can spend a warlock spell slot to deal an extra. Oh, okay. And the warlock spell is level three, so oh, that's a lot. Mm. Okay, now he needs to make a DC sixteen save. Uh, what strength save? Strength. I'll be prone. Alright, oh. C16. And take 32. Kuda kuda dekuat. Holy shit. Kuda kuda oh. ku gaga berani. Holy <laughs> shit. This guy is sick. It, it is for the first attack, eh? For the first attack. Alright. Oh, so for the first, okay? No, you can only use one attack. Huh? You don't have the crossbow, the crossbow feet. Oh. Don't is have fast can... reload. Yep. Uh, it's still next turn. Yeah, it's a reload okay. function. Yeah, but 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 you you get to add another uh three damage because of your hex. Oh, yeah, that's true. Hex. Another hmm. three damage. Yeah. All right, added damage. Okay, cool. <sighs> okay, then with that, I'm gonna work on your thing. All right, the eldritch blood uh might. Damage, does it? Can it or not? Force, right? And then, can it, uh, can it lah? Okay, can but it, alright. Uh, when hit there, ah, uh, did you get? Alright, so. so can it accept the tak kena prune je lah. Oh yeah, yes, that's the prune. Alright, it will take that 22 force damage. Boom! You can see the, the earth, uh, underneath the Obaki's feet crack as he withstood the, or uh, attempt to knock it prune. It does take damage. Tetapi kuda-kuda dia kuat. <laughs> oh my god. Strong. So, Kenis. That's how he took the key damage. Go on, toilet. Ooh, lamanya. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Go on, toilet. <laughs> He is killing something, ah. Uh. <laughs> Shall I go now? <laughs> oh, I. Uh, what, what, what are you two doing? Mm, one, two, three. Oh, that's a wire. Uh, um. Uh, hmm. How yes, GM? Move. Go, go, go okay. ahead. Go, 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 go. Okay. Do you want to shift? It's here at the toilet, right? Yeah. Do, do you want to okay. shift the position a bit? Let uh oh, he wants to hit the over. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. That's all uh, I know. Um, I'm guessing do the same thing again. All right. Hunter's mark is still on him, right? Yes, it's still on the over. Okay. Yep. <coughs> oh, he, uh, he he's coming. Okay. He coming. Okay, he came. Ah. <laughs> uh... <laughs> you guys ruin everything. Huh? This yeah, is yeah, why yeah. every week the GM is trying to kill us. <laughs> so much hit, yes. <laughs> Let the hit flows. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> All right, Kenny, it's your turn. Uh, what do you want to do? Same target. Okay, cool. All right, roll, roll, roll the bow. I think it's blocked, right? Yeah, unless the bow can. <laughs> uh, still, still 
is you can okay can still be seen he can still try to have that okay so what it does hit 17 hits um roll for hunter's mark Okay, and then roll, roll for your D6 acid damage. <laughs> Already. But that is poison. Acid, acid, not poison. Wait, what? There's no yeah, piercing no, uh, because of arrow. Like, uh, the stats are a bit messed up. Yeah. yeah. The first one is from the arrow. the physical arrow. Mm -hmm. The Set magical seven. arrow. <laughs> the magical arrow. Second is the... Hunter's mark. The hunter's mark. And then this the one is one the poison, yeah. right? Acid, mm. acid, 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 acid. So roll, roll your second attack, I guess. Yeah, finish. Yeah, finish. Yeah, roll your second attack. Oh. That's Ooh. eleven to no, That's no bonus, right? Twelve, twelve. Yeah, bonus minus one. So it's 12. Wait, yeah. 12. Did it hit you? It does hit. Oh. So just roll 2d6 to make it easier. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. Six. Oh that is for... 2d6 for the... Hunter Smoke and what? Acid. So, uh, right. take 5 piercing and then... Uh, okay. Hunter Smoke is 3 and then... I see this tree. So it's necro? I remember this. Oh boy. By the way, I think it's an undead. Yeah, I see that as well. Ah! It's undead, you say? We don't know. It could, it could be a insect. It's like something. Hive mine as well. Anything else, Kenneth? Oh boy. Uh, do I get hit yeah. when I move back? Mm. Yes. You, you may suffer an attack opportunity. You want to risk it? Let me check my pocket for makan ubat. Oh, ubat nyamuk. Alright. Okay, no. Shen, your turn. Ah, uh, god damn it. I got you, you, you can you can you can handle the back the back, right? Protect Lady Mara, right? For now, I think. But I do, uh, yeah, we'll go in front. Of the guys are not. I need there. also to assist Greg for healing. Oh yes, thank you. But um, kind of too late actually because I won't be close to you. No, no, uh, it's okay because I can heal you from afar. Okay. <coughs> in aggro. <coughs> Okay. A A O P. All right, the swarm of wasp. Nine. Yeah, no, we won't attack. Why? Because you already used up this reaction. Did it? Oh yeah, Karasu. Yep, yep, Karasu. Oh yeah, yeah, yep, yep, yep. <laughs> you took advantage of that. Ah, uh, yeah, having Karasu become the cannon fodder. <laughs> it wasn't me, but yeah, I tell I tell the guys to take care of Mara. <laughs> or you can have that. Uh, suddenly, uh, Shen says, "Look there to the swamp <laughs> of us and run past it <laughs> while he's looking at someone else." Nani, Nani, Nani. Uh, I can't do anything for, for now. Yeah. Alright, Wolf. <laughs> what? 
what I can say, Wolf, we need to focus on healing. Uh, uh. This one, this one that's really low. Uh. Can I use a, um, if I use my healing word, but a second spell slot instead of the first? That would yes, be a, yes, you can. a bonus so action? I cast it at level 2, right? Yep. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cast a level 2 healing word. On Kanis. Yeah, that's a bonus action. That's you, you're here, okay. Uh. Ah, that, okay, yeah, that's the one. Where is, why is no click? Because that's for description, oh. I think you need to click on the spell. You need to... That's one, I saw it's a plus one. Seven, right? A... Yeah, that's a D4. Yeah. Do I have already D4? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. It's already uh, rolled. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, so seven. Six, seven. Seven. Yeah, seven. See, and then, uh, this. See. Are the bees flammable? You can yeah. try. They are bees, right? They got wings. <laughs> Unless Log they're made of steel. Logically, in real life, also. so you can burn. Oh. I mean, it's everything like burns. You just have to try it. I'm gonna hit this. Well, oh, no, it is. I'm gonna hit this swamp. Okay. With this. Fire Ooh. bolt. Mm, nice. Nice. Sixteen. Uh, I'm dead. Ooh. Oh, dead. You burn it to cinders. It's all crispy. It's not even edible after that. Mm. <sighs> so, Greg, it's your turn. You are surrounded by wasp. Okay. Uh, I'll run through. It was Obake holding my great oh. axe. Wow. So, uh Ooh. Ooh, that's a hit. Ooh. That is a hit. That oof, that is a hit. hit, hit. Uh, piercing. Uh GM half. Uh five, six and five. Five, six, five, sixteen, eh? Uh, five, yes, six, yes, six, yes, six, yes, five. Yes, yes. Give me a second to ponder. Five, six, five. Um, I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to take the ten first. Mm -hmm. That's, and then I'm going to use my reaction to reduce the six. With stone endurance, so there's a D twelve. Yeah, um, I think the pasato. With the with the two d six one, right? No, no. Uh, still endurance one d twelve plus wait, two. Wait. You can't take a reaction uh, on your turn. Oh, can okay, I? All right, I'll take the six, huh? Sorry, uh, I'll take the. Wait, uh, six. Is uh. You can use. Mistaken. You can use a reaction on your turn if you meet the appropriate trigger for the reaction. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. So yes, you can. Ah, okay. So, alright, cool. Uh, I will roll the d12. Minus 3 plus 2, 5. That's not how much GM damage? Uh, 6, right? It's, uh, 6, the last uh, one. I'll take the one. Oh, up in Good job. Alright. <clears throat> okay, right in front of this, um, Obake, gonna swing my great axe at him. Reckless. Ooh, okay. Fourteen. All right. So it hits. Then again. 
15, ooh! 5, 15, 16, wow. 17. Bad. Oh, that's 7? 17. Maximum? Almost, almost. And then, uh, pfft, I'll end my turn, I'm screwed. <laughs> Oh, uh, where's the EOT? Alright, here you go. Okay, Gregory can hit the air. Uh... Alright. Right. Uh, as I saw Greg. Recklessly hitting <laughs> dog with the lucky. Okay. <laughs> Technically, I did! <laughs> it is true. <laughs> <laughs> Hang in there, man! And then I'll just cause. Anyone? Bonus action. Healing word. <laughs> Seven plus three. Ten. Seven plus three. Ten. Thank you. And then at the same time, I will hold up my sickle to the air and hopes the moon shines so it's bright. And then that's uh, that's that creature. The spirit wolf oh. moves onto his location as an action. So basically, he is right on top here? Yeah. On you. Okay, cool. Uh, that is, I can trigger it directly or on you his turn. I'm not quite sure. Check. Uh, not for me, that's. That's a. Uh, it's coming in. It's a spirit. It's very easy. Here, GM. There, okay. Ah, uh, here. I'll be on top. Uh, let's see if I can move a bit. Alright, All right, there we go. Healing. Yeah. Whenever you or a creature can see move into the spirit space for the first time on a turn or start its turn there, mm. you can cause it. So, on your turn, mm -hmm. is it? Yeah. So, that's that. That's the clause. Uh, yep. And... I... <laughs> that's all my actions. Economy and then I have to end the thing. Alright. <laughs> now things get interesting. You for Shen and Greg, you mm -hmm. see the Obaki looks around. There's pure hatred in his eyes. And now it's, it's just as it opened his mouth, more was started coming out of it. Mm. And it will release more swarm. Two more swarms. Mm. The heck? Two swarms? Yes. And then it just did something unexpected. What the hell? What's going on? It just something started swirling and the swarms that surrounds its nest started to engulf it. Wow. The boss second form. Oh no, the token's not looking right. <laughs> yes, it started swirling and swirling and swirling. And then the swirl suddenly started to dissipate into nothingness. Hmm? The GTFO? You are not sure what ha what happened, but the swarm that that it turns out is still there. And started this one started attacking Shen. Miss. Miss. Second one started attacking Greg. Miss on eight. <laughs> this one started oh, wait, swarming. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, wait. Since you missed me. Yes. It's time to eat some damage. Oh god. <laughs> Ten. Uh, plus the eight. Uh, the eight. Uh, oh, three, three. Thirteen. Not bad. Not bad. The swarm seems to be suffered a lot from that attack, and it started to reduce in numbers tremendously. Okay, 
as this one, this one is looking to attack Karasu. Miss. I'll see moving. <laughs> Doing. And this one starts attacking. Doing. Boing. Those, those <laughs> testicles are very sturdy. <laughs> okay, the last swarm that is in front of Edgar. But attacking Edgar. Miss? 13, I think it misses. I'm, my eyebrow class is 14. Okay. Okay. It seems like it's listless without a full tactician behind it. Karasu, it's your turn. Because it's first encounter with the third guy. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to use my bonus action. Okay. To conjure your thought, is it the rapier? No. No, no, really. No, no, I'm going to use something that uh, GM grants to me. Yeah, let's see, what is it? I know what's the the cloak. A cloak of. Cloak of no. flies. Classic <laughs> <laughs> flies. Flies versus wasps. Battle <laughs> <laughs> of the century. <laughs> oh god. It's a battle of insects. Uh, play flight of the bubble bee. Uh, so they will take five damage, eh? Yeah, the aura extends five feet from you. Then with that, I'm just gonna swing my rapier. Boom! Wait, 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 is your rapier is it's a pack weapon? Uh, okay. Should be, right? Didn't the yeah, it if it is when you conjure your crossbow, it will disappear. Oh no! <laughs> Only your crossbow is with you currently. You can conjure up to one type weapon at a time. I think. Yep. <clears throat> Spiritual weapon, form of flies water. <laughs> 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 You, suddenly, you, your cloak of flies started turning on you <laughs> when you as soon as you <laughs> have a fly swatted. <laughs> oh, it's some woke flies. Oh god, no! Okay, my rapier is actually a a what? A real rapier, lah. Okay, it doesn't. But if like, I you... yeah, I think I think if you conjure that one, the the rapier will turn into just a common hand crossbow. Yeah, no, normal, normal rapier. Oh. Does it have the plus one to copy to it? No. Yeah, it doesn't have the plus one anymore. Yeah. It's just All right. normal. So it's normal, so there's no plus one. Alright. Yes. Alright. Still still okay. Still okay. Swing bada bada bada. On which one? On um, this one. Okay. Oh, yeah. Mm, nine. You see? Oh, okay. Then another attack. Seventeen, nine. Same target? Same target. Okay, same target. Now it's greatly reduced. You you use it almost like a fly swatter. <laughs> <laughs> and then with that, I'm gonna EOT. All right. So, Kenis, your turn. You are in the clear. Oh, that's something. Oh. He's asleep? Lol. <laughs> really? Give him the kiss of life. Oh no. Yeah, give, him the, give him the kiss. Oh, he will wake up. Oh uh, no. <clears throat> I guess 
Same pattern? No. How He's to up. then? Lol. He's up. He's up. He's up. Yeah, you kiss him? I see, I see. Not enough. Uh, targeting? I, I, I guess this one? Okay. Why is Kenny's me on Hmm, AC. Uh, I remember around 15, 16. Ah, 16. 16. Uh, near Wolf's Lady Mara, so this one. Okay. Don't fumble, don't fumble. Okay. All right, let's go. Ebony, ten piercing. Ebony dragon bow. That sounds so. Uh, also do. That's six for hunter's mark. Another six for asset. One, seven, dead. Another attack, right? So. This, this, uh, three and five carousel. All right, which one? This one. This one. All right. Uh, that hits, I guess. Yeah, hits. Eleven piercing. Now two d six. Uh, for, no hunter smoke. Hunter smoke. Can he switch hunter smoke? Yeah, yeah. Only he, can. he can cast That's it again. As a bonus That's action, a bonus he move it right. No, yep. he, can, he can cast it because the bonus action only applies if the target is dead. Yeah, so you need to. This is dead. No, no, no. The, the 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 target wasn't this. The target was Obake. Obake. Yeah, yeah. Not, uh, yeah. He recast it on this. Yeah, yeah. He recast yeah. it on this. Oh so yeah. That, then you need to use our bonus action but to can, move it here, lah. Correct. Yeah, but but then again, he used the bonus action to cast it. Ah, right. so yeah, so, so it's used up already. Yeah. Alright, so basically just right. 1d6. This one, right? Yep. So, roll 1d6. For acid damage. 3, mm, half, not bad. <laughs> okay. Nice. nice! It's just enough to, to kill it. <laughs> kill it. There's two attacks already, cool. Now it's Shen's turn. Yeah, Shen, Shen's get is just glad that he gave him the bow. <laughs> <laughs> you have a lot of fun with it. <sighs> you know what, Jam? I'm gonna yep. do this on the Swan of Wasp. So, this one, this one? The one that okay. I attacked. So okay. Right. Mm -hmm. 15. Hmm? Is it hit, Jam? It does hit. 15 hits. Okay, 9 plus 4 fire damage. 8 slashing, sorry, 9 slashing, 4 fire. And then another one. Uh, 13. Uh, wait, 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 the first one died already. Yeah. Oh, then I'll hit the second one, the second one. Alright, so, uh, that's 15, right? 15 plus 2. Yeah, 15 plus 2. It hits at 13? Yeah. It does. Okay, so it's 15 plus 2. And that's it. And my turn. Chen now is holding a fire fire sword. Mm. Oh, a fireball here would be so dramatic. <laughs> Overkill, but still. <laughs> Don't use a fireball now. Huh? <laughs> 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 no fireball now. <laughs> that... <laughs> Sorry, no we, we, we need more fire. We need more Vespin gas. Mm, we fireball. didn't start the fire. 
All right. Not at all today. Oh. So, Wolf, what are you going to do? Counting. I'm on mic! <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, moving a front <laughs> one space. Thinking about doing range attack at the swarm. Okay. So what anything else what? you want to do? What are you going to do? About the, about, about hit. Do I want to hit that one or... Do you want me to hit that swarm or do you have that swarm under control, Mr. Shen? Shen is okay, I think. That one, that one. Ah. You, want to take it, take, you want to take it out so it's good? So Gregory I'm... can get more freely. Good point. Ama, okay, I'll hit this one. Okay. Hit this. Totally dead. All right. I don't know if it works because they're the bees, but. Bees! <laughs> Let's see whether they are white bees. Oh, it's the bees. They are white. They are white. They are white. Oh, yeah. bees. On the dot. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Even at minus two. Hey, Jay, 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 can, 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 can I can I retalk on the behalf of the of the of the of the thing? How? What? The, can, can I can I retalk on behalf of you? For for you? Yeah, sure. Yeah. The wasp say that I'm not bees, I'm a wasp. Different... <laughs> <laughs> you can't text me. <laughs> you're so, you're so bad at identifying insects. <laughs> Go back to school. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <no>. <laughs> Wow. So, uh, okay, with the, the okay, what does like it that? hit? No, 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 no. nothing. No, no. no. it does no. not. No, no. Ah. Uh, uh, da 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 da. I wanna use. Can I use this? Not, how do I? How do I like? Can I use this? You can Ooh, spell. You can. Yes, you can. I'm gonna use it. What do you want to do? And then I'm gonna use. Uh. So that then. I'm gonna use this. I can't wait. Oh no. Click this on. I this see splash. Oh, that's smart. Oh, nice. Ooh. Slash. Dex 15 or take uh, 8 acid damage. Mm. Next, eh? They should be yes. fast, I think. Oh, it's supposed to be fifteen. It'll be an end. Sorry, uh, they got oh, bane, it's... right? Uh the bane. All bane swarms are dead. Uh, wait, no. This, this. Oh, okay. One, it was two. one, this one, and this one. Okay. They did. It fails. Not that fast. Uh, fails. It has it. Fails. It has it. So it as here, right? Wait, directly yeah. eight or just oh you're already dead no, 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 roll already. One died. Okay, I'm done. Heal, All right, heal. um I'm in Regal. the spot. Heal, heal, heal. How is it G? how is it like how do you do the healing? Yeah. Then. Four, all right, no problem. One, two, three, four. Um, I'll take out the great axe reckless on the swarm. All right, 26, uh, oh. 13. Oh. Thing, <laughs> you just swat it out of the air and it's just died. All right, um, the remaining move up with four in front of this one. Uh, hmm. give me a second. Attack again. Yep, attack, attack again. Nine. Nope. Why? Gem hits? No, it does not hit. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Uh, I think I use up all my movement, so I will end the turn there. Alright. I'll the one that is right in front of me. Died. Died. The, the only one is alive here. Yes, yes, yes. Yep. I will tennis racket. Uh, 
produce flame onto them. <laughs> okay, <laughs> then it's okay. Oh, you're doing the Priest of Tennis thing, making sure it yep. hits on the spot. 14 hits! Oh, hits. 9 fire. This Ooh. one, right? That's the only legit target boss. Yep. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, still. And then, as a bonus action, I think I will move the wolf spirit. Hmm. Who is badly injured? Um, between me and Kenneth, I think. Wait, no. Uh, what about you, Karasu? Um, uh, at half left point. Ah, Karasu lah. Yeah, move on to Karasu. Hmm. Mm, All right. Good. My... Good. Because mm. after this, it'll be, uh, her yep. turn. Yep. And then that's all of my turn. Okay. Karasu. Wait. Triggers. Wait. Mm. Wait. Before Karasu is the Obaki at the end. I yeah, think so. Gone. Yeah. Yeah, but the swarm has to move also. Oh, okay. okay. So, the swarm. With that, it will... Attacking? Attack. Yeah, attacking Karasu. Only one. Miss. One for one. Yes. <laughs> Alright, that's it. Okay, Karasu, your turn. Uh, it takes 5 uh, poison damage. Oh, f- uh, 5? Yeah, on his yeah. turn. Because of the fly. Oh, yeah! yeah. <laughs> so, 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 before, so, so before I... So, uh, <laughs> before the attack... Oh, God! Mm. Oh, the flies no. win! <laughs> flies versus Wolf. Because the, the swarm of Wolf is only uh, reduced to a fraction of its full... HP. Uh, numbers. Mm. <laughs> it just died. Okay, so GM. That, uh, done? Done. Alright. Um, I am going to go check up on Lady Mara. So, the healing spirit is still on. Who wants to? I have three triggers left. Yeah, let let so, take up Sue and Kenneth use it. Uh, 1d6 plus 24, is it? I I think um I got with a roll for yeah. you. So it's a uh, five plus three. Uh can this as well, right? Can this you're quite quite badly wounded, right? There is two more triggers. Line okay. up this. Yeah, 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 Conga. So then can it... Okay. Break point. Six. Six. And one more trigger. Who's want to take the last trigger? Kenneth uh, or Agat or whoever. Uh, let's check on Lady Mara Wait. first. So I guess I guess Karasu or Kenneth, which one you want? So um, Kenneth, why is your hit you right now? Still have the Kenneth, ah. Uh. So I. I don't. Any one of you, ah, like, whoever you want. All right. So uh, Lady Mara. Uh, I'll just so, so far, Lady Mara um, is uninjured, mm-hmm. but you see the glow from her started to subside as the danger seems to have passed. But mm-hmm. you cannot help to notice a certain look of resolution on her face. And then she says, I am done being helpless. I must train myself in the arts. Of the sword. I mean, you could use something else, but still, good on you. And um, I'm describing how Gregory looks, a uh, face full of stings, <laughs> body stings. <laughs> Sting. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. So it's like all, all are swollen. <laughs> are, are you okay? Oh, I'm okay. Is, is it just? Is it just a flesh wound? <laughs> I'm okay. Um, it, it will, it, it, it will survive. It will survive. Unless I have an allergy. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> GM <Jam>, roll. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. By the way, uh, the spirit, uh, healing spirit already gone, and then that's the last. Whoever All takes right. it is three plus four. All right. <coughs> All right. Um. All right. There, there was an adventure, but um, let's not dilly dally. Let's head on out. We we right, spend let's... we spend a few seconds, here, a few minutes here. 
it's not waste any time. Technically, it's not even a minute. <laughs> yep. yep. Yeah, we spent a few oh. seconds here. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's go. So you, you just uh, gather yourself, and then you head into the night, yep. trying to make for lost time, and then you start your journey back. Come and on. double time is it? Uh, we we'll, uh, double time. What time is it now? Okay, by now it's about almost twelve. Hmm. All right. Uh, twelve double time. Uh, terrain. How bad is it if we double time it? Now you are in on the main road, so it does not seem to be that bad. All right. So uh, it's kind of smooth sailing. Uh, let's let's double time it and then um we can just rest. Sure. sure. All right. So as you work through the night, uh trying to make up for lost time and trying to hastily going but hastily but cautiously always on the lookout for danger at the crack of dawn you see the parapets and the of the Akuma castle on the hills mm. and at that you are near the gates of the Akuma estate and you finally reach your destination. And with that, we'll end the session for tonight. Yay! Oh shit! My God, do you remember? Yeah. You, you, you forgot something. What? Oh no! Forgot what? Oh man, you forgot something. What? Oh, um, while looking at Lady Mara taking care of her and heading out, I pick up my javelin. And we head out. All right. So we already left. Left it. It's not there anymore. We already arrived at the. Ah, see the way I describe it. Uh, oh, well, okay. you don't seem strangely. You cannot seem to find that javelin. <laughs> ah, GM, take away my <laughs> toys. That best near okay lah. No javelin. Tapa. No. Then, uh, as you arrive at the estate, you know, you see Sanchez Sen- 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 poke your back and then pass you the javelin. Because you forgot the javelin. <laughs> well, I was I was thinking about something else. Lady Mara. <laughs> yeah, you're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> you're lucky yeah. <laughs> yes, you did. Uh, yeah, so... but I was thinking about Lady Mara. <laughs> <laughs> careless. Uh, there's a careless. I mean, he has an <laughs> intelligence of eight. Come on. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so a good session tonight. So everybody will gain hundred XP from uh, this battle. Okay. And every, each and every one of you also hundred and fifty points for role playing. Nice. So tonight it it's a bit of a battle light session. So hopefully <laughs> that, you get it. That's what you said. Light. God dang it. <laughs> oh, Jeff. Two hundred fifty XP plus hundred fifty for role playing, right? Yes, hundred, uh, hundred plus hundred and fifty. Ah, okay, hundred plus okay, two fifty lah. Yes, two fifty total. total. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. So I hope you had fun. You had some new toys. Don't forget to <laughs> pick them up. Lay your toy. <laughs> yeah, pick them up. Yeah, boy. <laughs> and don't forget to call Shazam. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't forget to pick up your toys after you play. <sighs> It's not mum, you'll throw them away. No. <laughs> yeah. Still, still. Uh, Alright, anyway, so hope you guys had fun. Yep, yep. Uh, yeah. Enjoy your new toys. Uh, <laughs> do your stats for the toys properly. Mm-hmm. My, mine seems to be working just fine. Double checking, just trying again. Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's make, make sure you modify your bow properly. Yeah, yeah so, he's, he's asleep right now. <laughs> huh? That's all. Oh, Oh. Kiss, uh, you wake up again. <laughs> oh, yeah, there we anyway. go. Proper description. <clears throat> anyway, uh, have fun. Mm-hmm, Take care mm-hmm. now. Okay, right. I'll see you next yeah. time. Next session. Yeah, next session then. Boys. All right. <laughs>